baca. Halo, Ca. How do you do, Ca? Look at that. Look at that. So oh, nice. So bright and orange. <laughs> uh, well, first of all, Darth, thank you for the 102 bitties. And Azazel, thank you for the 501 bitties. And Dabser, thank you for the year. Welcome back. Oh, okay. Connection? Connection? What's happening? Not caught up yet. When I woke up this morning, it checked. That's when you ended stream. Do I watch now and be confused or catch up on yesterday? Um. Hmm. I guess that's up to you. There's, um, a lot that happened yesterday. <laughs> Like a lot, <laughs> actually. So anyway, how is everyone? Sorry, I'm recovering from a, a sneezing fit that I just had. Before I started. finished eating curry Ooh. you know i have never had curry in my whole life too much flavor maybe <laughs> I think my family just never had it when I was growing up. Like, we never had, like, any kind of... It's, uh, curry's Indian food, right? Typically. It's a lot of foods. 
there are different types? Okay, well, I know that my mom, when she was, uh, she used to always tell us a story, but when she was pregnant, uh, the smell of cooking curry was what gave her, uh, morning sickness. <laughs> so, uh, she never really recovered from that and couldn't, um, never really liked curry after that. And so we just never really had it. Yes, that was a blessing. It was indeed. Also, uh, Anonym69, thank you for the biddies. Oh my god. There's a, a shiny piece of uh, metal on my microphone. And I think my cat, like, walked by in the background. And I saw his reflection in the shine, and I thought it was a spider right next to my face. It just scared me so bad. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it must have been Skarn arriving. Uh, yes. Shelly did get free yesterday. So... The, um... The officers involved in that are going to have to figure out how to do a plea deal that's a little more sweet than it normally would be just because uh, she was in there for so long. But yes, as of right now, she is out of prison. She is still able to be charged, uh, but the plea deal is probably going to be a lot nicer just because of the situation and everything. And uh, she might have an avenue to sue, but we'll see. Q-tip, thank you so much for the prime. Uh, I don't, I don't really know if that's legal, APOC, to include that kind of thing. Um... But I don't know. I don't know enough about how that all works. <laughs> Every single time. Popcorn really does not like those fences.
This is something. Yeah, I know. This is popcorn. <laughs> what was that scream? Eee! She said. Uh, ZM, thank you for the three months. Crypto, thank you for the six months. Welcome back. Some weird swamp ladies riding a deer to work. Excuse you? Who are you calling a swamp lady? You're a swamp lady. What the heck? How actually dare. Hi. Do you mind if I use the ranger station to lock some evidence? No, not at all. All right. I love how I didn't question any of this. He just was like, uh... Okay. <laughs> You're a swamp potato is what you are, Tato. Subbing because of the deer ride to work. It's not the robot. Thank you for the sub. I appreciate that. Oh, man. my keys there you are thank you no problem you own the place after all You know, I wish there was a bus station nearby this place. Yeah? Wake up and come to work here. Well, then wouldn't the rangers be able to have their own meetings and stuff? Well... 
well, technically all the rangers can wake up here. Oh, really? Yeah, it's kind of a ranger exclusive thing. I didn't know that. That's cool. Speaking of which, I think I need to bring on one more person to that. Are we missing anyone aside from Avery? Oh, Luth, yes, okay. Uh, Kazaa, thank you for the 30 months. Welcome back. Alright, Tato, what was it you wanted? The short sleeve? No, I haven't got my Game Warden Stars yet. Gotta wait for Prolos. Uh, Shelly's not still in holding. She was released yesterday when Crane talked to me. Um, okay. Okay. So, I think what I'm going to do... Receptionist, product specialist, I think. I'm wondering if I should remove the bank access from... 
everyone other than me, Ziggy and Clarkson. Yeah, they can uh, still charge, but I, I feel like pay employee and pay external. This would mean that they can pay someone not employed. And this would mean that they can pay like an employee. So technically they could pay themselves or pay each other with the ranger funds. Oh man, Emo Gopher, thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs. You're amazing. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Jay Kanda, thank you for the 15 months as well. I think I'm going to do this, and if anyone complains, we'll figure, figure out how to fix it. Because I don't know who has access to this account. Not really sure what to do with that. Gray dog, thank you for the prime. I'll be honest, I don't even really know how to, like, check that.
No, we still haven't done the winky stuff yet. The right on ramp to power. Three apartments. Additions? Westbound. Uh, uh eight for, We could use two more. Uh, four eleven. Northbound, Alta Street. Oh, it's all the way down there. What's the class of vehicle? It's an A-class black Ellen. Uh, there was an interference vehicle, uh, not interference, but there was a vehicle on scene, a black buffalo occupied at least three times as well. What's the current? Left westbound, Flint Avenue. Right westbound, Flint Boulevard, passing. Oh boy, chat. Here we go. Copy that. Uh, Dispatch, could we get a channel for this? That Copy that, thank you. Manage on to South Mill. Drive, westbound. Right, eastbound. Picture perfect drive. Channel, middle. Channel? One. The last one, channel, is that sorry? Channel one. I don't know. What are you supposed to say shot? Well, there's projectiles on the building up there. Oh, I see. Hey, you see that? I've just been going to shots fired calls and just logging them, so I'm making these guns hot. Fair enough. Alpha 223, now we're one. I don't see anything else. How many interviews today? Hopefully none. <laughs> I'm all interviewed out, man. I'm so tired. Don't worry, I'll add you to the report. Thank you. So you get credit for being here. Finally, someone recognizes my effort. Uh, All right. Thank you. What's his bike? Hmm? Welcome aboard. 1041 at 7 11. Oh, no signs of force breaking. All right. Well, back to the ranger station, log all this evidence, and get back out there. Nice. Yeah, we had a couple interviews yesterday. Dispatch 270, show me 1041, any actives? Come aboard, Tessa, showing you 1041 at 104 p.m. EST, welcome aboard. 
It's, that's my thing, time. Copy that too, something. Monty, it's 1041, sir, 142. <laughs> now you eat that. Ah! Oh. 476, the latest 31 on Rancho. Copy that triple four, Monty, you on the road. Hey, what man, I think, uh... No, you didn't miss any Ranger announcements. We're not, uh... We haven't done anything with that yet. Alpha 8 pretty much, you uh, 10 8 no, zero, one fifty three. Alpha 2 10 8 Check. 10 2. What over here? Suspicious bicycle. Dispatch channel one's collapsed. I don't know where B and E would happen here. Could it be the store? That's Union three seven four ten forty two. Could it be Union three seven four much in ten forty two zero two zero two? Have a good night. Have a good night. Audible shots fired outside of yes. It's Fingal's in a lot, it's Fingal. Four eleven seventy six to... Where'd that guy go? ...for vehicle maintenance. How was this closed? Harmony. That's from PD. Send it. Okay. Uh, we need 52 as Legion Square. Finger was I feel like... And then somebody tried to stop him. I feel like that's my guy, but I don't have any proof. I don't know which building it was. It's code 4 so far. I don't see any vehicle. Nothing. Copy. What? Okay, hold on. Yeah, mark it code for. I'll go back, uh, Teddy. Hello. Come on, Marky. Teddy, zero two thirty. And can I help you? What's uh, what's going on out here tonight? No, I don't know. I was, I was, I was, I'm just transferring some shit from the apartments of the truck, innit? From, from your apartment to the truck. Yeah. Five seventy-seven. Show five seventy-seven. Oh, okay. Operating under Jeffrey Bones, nine oh three. Why? Marcus oh. ten oh. eight. Oh no, you're not just there. Yeah, you know, on, on your own for the worst. Well, copy that. Nine oh three, Marcus ten eight zero two. Well, the first thing, your vehicle is yeah, parked backwards. Were you aware of that? Oh. It was Not parked that point way, point but then I went in, and then I come out, and it was parked the other way. I'm not even meant to be driving it, you know, but I couldn't just leave it there. That's a danger to society, and I ain't even got a license. Oh, it's a you don't have a... What do you mean you have a suspended license and you're driving well, the car? Well, I mean, the cops have just been going mental recently, haven't they? Brown and color... What do you mean? Suit? You can't be driving this well, if you're... I wasn't. I wasn't going to, you know. It, it was exactly where your car was parked, facing the right way and everything. But then I went into my apartment, two minutes later I come out and it was down there. You even saw it and that. Okay, so you were It weren't... was a danger to public safety. I couldn't just leave it there. You weren't driving it? 
Well, no, I mean, I drove it, but only, you know, like two centimetres up here. All right. Now, I'm actually here because there was a, a burglary alarm can going I, off. Can I get, like, a couple units? But, uh... uh circling the, I, the medical center, Crusade the Medical Center's car park. It's opposite the what? street from Crusade. It's medical. Uh, holding somewhere inside with a knife. So is that apartment your apartment? I mean, one of them is. I, I, I mean, not all of them. But there's a lot of apartments there. It's a big building. Yeah, you got me there, actually. Yeah. I mean, you can check me on, on, the, on the MDW if you really need to. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, 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 what's there, your name? Yeah, no globals. Uh... Say it again? Again, no globals. You have a state ID number. Uh, 42703. How about our Mochi 10802244? Pay to be advised because 1071 is what the phone is. That's not what he said. 354 Cover that three. Cover that three under Mochi 1042042. Alright. Sounds good enough to me. Okay, just uh, make sure you just park this up, okay? I don't want to see you driving it around, okay? Well, I'm not, I'm just, I'm, you know, I'm just, I'm trying to transfer shit, innit? You know, I'm just fucking too much space, and that. I'm, I'm just, it's just here, I didn't mean to, around. Alright, well, just be careful with it, alright? Yeah, you do. I hope you got right. some fucking burglars, I don't yeah, want to burglar you. another burglar rise in my place. Yeah, I couldn't imagine. Uh, 394 and a 38 with the bloom color GTR eastbound by Boulevard, nearest cross uh, Elgin. So many V and E's right now. Reality is, I think those are like public apartments, not public, but um, actual apartments. So I, it looks sus, but I, I can't. I don't think I can prove it. And technically, I didn't see him driving the car. He did admit to driving it. But at the same time, if it got pushed somewhere and he moved it, that's fine. I'm not going to hassle him for that. I don't think that's a Fleeka. It's going to be a storefront on Vinyl Boulevard. Yeah. Yeah, 308 is attempting to pull over a dark gray and colored bison. Three fifty four twenty three latest seventy one's code six. Alright, three oh eight ten to be northbound Las Vegas Boulevard, dark like a black colored bison marked by one two at least four times. Seventy seven. Four one five. Wanna stay at the location where the thirty ones are and see if I see any evidence. Also, a white in color, uh, it's like a Porsche just pull up and honk at me. Right outside the front, storefront, and fine one. They're taking off, I need 77s. She's pulling this ledge hammer. Pull two. 603. I'm coming her. See ya. Well, thank you. 23. Still my car. What's the 20 of that? Black, Black in color, bison taking off westbound Spanish Avenue. Through it, secondary westbound Spanish. 3730, 736, latest 99 out, switching beach, dispatch, defenders, channel. Left, southbound, east, four way. Okay, 31 Alpha 1080, switch to channel 3, 31 Alpha, channel 3. Continuing westbound, east, four way, passing behind the courthouse. Passengers are throwing shoes, make sure to check the radio. Alright, right. Uh, westbound, 
southbound movie star one a passing in front of Weasel Plaza. You guys need a fourth unit or are you good with three for break off? Uh, uh we're parallel since there's four in the car. Eastbound San Andreas. Temple. Continuing eastbound San Andreas, passing under the Puerto Freeway, passing Red Garage. Oh my god, that code 411 initiative. Hello? Hello? Hi, Warden Lamb. Added 99. How are you Hello. doing? Channel Good, how are you? I'm okay, thank you. Uh, I have a couple of things I need to talk to you about. I just spoke to Jeffy, in fact. Uh, give me an update on the situation that happened last night that you responded to. Oh, the gunshots? Yeah, he found a... Uh, he, he said he found uh, a note slightly after that, which he'd gone to tell you about. Uh, which had a picture of Dahlia at that house. The gunshots uh, were found. Does he have it? Like, did you get it documented or do I need to go and do that? I've, I've done all of that already for you. Uh, I just wanted to make sure that you were updated since okay. you were one of the primary people. Uh, I put it all in that report already. Uh, I said, you know, you were around. So if, if you wanted to... Talk to him or he wanted to talk to you that could happen but i've already put in all the statement uh he gave me as well as the the images okay i wasn't uh terribly involved in that one i think um bison and flop were more actively involved i was kind of i'll be honest i was snacking in the car and bison was driving me around so oh okay <laughs> all right i don't quite remember as much as uh i should probably um honestly it's snacks take priority they're important <laughs> that's fine but, uh, if he would like to follow up with me that's fine uh i was i was sort of present i was a little spaced out is all that's, um that's, that's fine I'll, uh, as long as it's documented uh i'm good uh and the other thing i spoke to ziggy this morning uh, and he, well, I spoke to Conan yesterday as well. Uh, he have been going around because I would like to speak to each of the departments about what they offer. And I was hoping I could speak to you about it as well. However, Ziggy said that there was going to be some whole like interview thing and all three of you were going to be there. I don't know if he's mentioned that to you. Uh, he has. You're on our interest list. Um... I don't know if uh, us three getting together for an interview is going to happen uh, anytime soon. We've all kind of uh, sort of dropped off doing that a little bit. Okay. But, um, I mean, obviously I could talk to you. And have you already talked to Clarkson? Uh, yeah. Clarkson mostly wanted me to uh, set up a date between him and my son, Boris, the bear. In, in order uh, to, to, to get a, like, a quick slot in. I, 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 I'm all, I'm, <laughs> to be honest with you, I, I don't, I don't want to do that. Yeah, well, that's fair and reasonable. Um, sorry he did that. He's, um... No, it's, it's fine, I, I get it. Boris is a big, big, beautiful fancy bear but he is only three years old and it, honestly he's got a lot of learning to do yeah uh well i will see if i can make time for an interview um i i don't want to make any promises today because i'm a little bit uh but my energy's low right now that's quite all right that's quite all right but I'm sure we will see each other within the next week or so, so I'm not too concerned about that. Um... <laughs> I don't know, you want to talk to him? Go ahead. So yeah, uh, well, well, I'll, I'll make time for you. With you. Yeah, I'll touch base with you later on in the week then, uh, when you're, okay. you're feeling a little more energetic and, and up for it. Alright. 
Alright, well, I appreciate your time, okay? Thank you, Winston. You're still okay. on our list, don't worry. Well, that's that's good to hear. Alright. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, right, Lamb. Huh. <sighs> Lamb, thank you for the gift of the Dinosauria and to Metal Detective. And for the additional gift of sub. Thank you so much. Hello, Warden Lamb. I hope you're doing well. I wanted to ask if certain dogs hate the color orange may seem like a silly question, but my roommate's dog, Zigzag, really likes to bite me in the middle of the night. Don't know who else to ask, so I apologize if this question is below your status. <sighs> Land, thank you for the subs. You're amazing. Thank you, thank you. Oh man, chat, I'm so tired. What? Thank you for being a champ about him. Coming up for 11, marching on route. Be advised that 57 in the area is going to be a bit such a full job and cost him out. Triple four, 76. I just had another 31 there. 354, same traffic. No, I haven't been going since last night. I feel like I have because I did not sleep right at all, but I'm okay. Yeah, I slept like doo-doo. I went to bed and I woke up probably like every hour. Get a sort of 31 alpha on cars and switch to channel 3. Channel 3, 31 alpha. Copy. Uh, Email from dispatch. Send it. Requesting 52 is MRPD. Okay, alpha 70 and 72. Twenty-three of the latest thirty-one alpha. Coming up for eleven, it's gonna be on channel three. This is thirty-eight northbound Elgin with a black Cognacetti uh, occupied one time by Cheddar. Coming up for fifty. Traffic less traffic than the additional zero maybe. Guys, uh, thank you so much for backing me up. I appreciate the love. Thank you. You're welcome. How was your day? So far, so good. Nothing yeah, crazy happening. Yeah. Uh, not yet, not yet. But you know, give us some time. It will. Okay. Hey, uh. Yeah. 
Has um Crane reached out to you at all? Yeah, um, I don't want to talk about it yet till we discuss it. Okay. Uh, you know, or, you know, discuss it. Yeah. Orally. All right. Uh huh. Right. That way, at least uh, whenever I open my mouth about the conversation, I, I know what's going on exactly. So I'm not going back and forth. Okay. Sounds good. All right. Yeah. It's just uh, I, I don't want to jump into any gun. That's all it is. No problem. Thank you. Thank you for being Thank understanding. You, Steam, how's it going? Uh, Mercedes Super Class, occupy at least one time. Hold on for if you want more team traffic, just look at any additional sort of thing. Because we just had a BMW speed out of the area. Uh, guys, I'm gonna call this 57, code 4. Here, boys. They're on channel 4, Wrangler. Uh, I'll try to channel 3. Yeah, there was a, there was a speeding white vehicle that left the area as we were approaching. More than likely our culprit. That was the uh, call on Milton Road? Uh, that was the call at the docks. Hey, firm. 29-23 and 31 at Milton. No cars here. I'm just gonna cut for a bit. Two coats of glitch robbery. Milton Road. I just. I said if I was gonna break off the dog scene uh, back hey. today. <laughs> What's hey. going on, guys? Nothing, but... Yeah, I got a motorcycle over here, uh, leaving the Milton Road scene. What's your route? Occupied two times. We have motor. Do we have a motor unit that can attach? It's coming out. Um, I'm VCB. Alright, it's south of Milton, south, merging east towards the Clips Towers. Right south towards Eclipse Boulevard, stand by crossing Eclipse. And we're going east on Eclipse Boulevard. 42 seconder, continuing east on the east Eclipse. No, that wasn't clear. Which channel 1? Channel 1, 1080. And Spanish. Going down a staircase to an alleyway. Heading back up towards the cliffs. BCB, standby direction. Or West Bounty Cliffs. A plus motorcycle, right? Uh, unknown. Uh, I think so. Now southbound Milton Road. Uh, left. Eastbound Hawick. Eastbound Hawick, past the bank. Crossing over Las Lagunas. Still really not used to this for us. I haven't had much time to drive this thing. Trooper 
right going through the alleyway, foot. going to the tennis court towards the Elgin, coming, stand by. Coming out to Elgin, and it's taking a right, it's going south. Sure. Sorry, true. Vehicle heading off-road, northbound, opposite lane, the travel, Los Santos Freeway. Working correct lane. Pass in the casino. Vehicle going off-road, heading off towards the casino. Vehicle turning into the casino, heading southbound through the parking lot. Oh, yeah, motor. Left. Southbound Merriford Boulevard, right, eastbound, correction, southbound Tangerine, BCB. Last scene around the park over by Mirror Park. You can check over this by the soccer field if someone else can check over. Rose, if you don't mind checking over by the alleyways by the taxi, they may have went through a tight squeeze over there. Oh, they're going towards the Los Santos Freeway. They're going, they're coming all the way down towards the canal right now. Oh, you got him! Pull off the bike, by the way. Okay. Hell yeah! All right, good work. Okay, one got on the bike. The one foot, which is going to be picked up now. They're still south. <laughs> I'm so confused. Continuing south in the canals past the warehouse, and taking it towards the train track. Be. Heading towards Little Bighorn, pushing southbound. Continuing southbound Little Bighorn. Right westbound Center's Passage. Heading through the alleyway everyone runs to get to work. Left westbound Integrity Way. Left southbound Strawberry. Right westbound San Andreas. Right northbound Elgin. Come on, give it up. Passing pillbox, continuing northbound Elgin. Left westbound occupation. Right northbound <laughs> power, opposite lanes of travel. Left through an alleyway parallel to. Alcoholic, right northbound, all the place, heading through another oh, alleyway. Uh, Rose, they're going to be coming back power, and around towards power. you. Is that motor unit right now to pursue with us? It's Rose. Last scene headed back out onto power, don't know what direction, probably south though. Uh, last scene going through the alley by the pink cage, uh, heading back towards Alta, or correction power. BCB, uh, continuing through the alleyways to Spanish BCB. They may have pushed through more of the alleyways. That's where they've been going through. What direction? Down on I uh, last thing going what fan? We're going nothing on Howick. Maybe Spanish. I think they may be between Altus Power and one of those alleyways. Rose, if you can go to the uh, alleyways in between Ulta and Power, Red Rome, where Bass and I are, I'm laughing around these alleyways. That's the key code system, that's where we last saw it. past him to go like up yeah I think uh shove motor pushing westbound that's when we uh, lost eyes Film that shit. Uh, <laughs> oh I got him there's south Van Alta right westbound Hallwick left south Van Alta Tessa. 
going through the park. They're heading towards Del Perro. What, east or west? Uh, westbound. They're go taking the uh, exit up towards Dorset. Ah! Whew. I'm going south right now. 49, got it. Continue west on it. 8 miles of parkway towards City Hall. I thought I heard him. We're uh, northbound of Milton, right eastbound Eastbourne Way, going through uh, one of the Bennies. Um, off to Carcer Way Tunnel, eastbound. Passengers on radio. Oh God, please! This I'm so bad with this car right now. It's not even funny. I'm really struggling with this. Keep going eastbound, elbow east. And out onto Meteor now. This is what they want. Last scene headed through the alleyway, coming out to Meteor. Mm, don't know where else, but they could have went. I know, uh, I know who that was. It was, um, the girl who drove up to me. She was the one that shot us at the hunting zone that one time. I can never remember her name. She's from Mortel. Oh, I got them in pink cage. Yeah, I got them. Yeah, oh my one God, really? Cage. One is trying to steal a bike. One leaving east by pink cage bank. Focus on the one with the motorcycle right now, push him westbound. Go inside the pink cage. Alright, 195 is just this one on the bike, she's going west. On, I'm gonna stay go with the rose, go get her. Stay back with us, back there, make sure she's back up. Let's just uh, rose this pursuit. <laughs> We're going off road towards Del Perro behind the old courthouse. Eastbound, VCB. We're gonna go around. Northbound, Elgin. Are you okay, ma'am? Going off-road towards Delta Freeway. You just crashed, you just crashed. Help me, help me, please, help me, help me, please. You guys in your stupid skinny alleyways, all right? What do you need help with? Someone help me, please. Someone help me, please. Someone help me, please. Someone help me, please. If I have friends that can hear me, please help me. All right. Merging correctly into travel, getting northbound, let's go to this freeway. I saw that other girl on the motorcycle. The casino. Uh, her bike's out. Her bike's out. Okay, well, don't worry. That is a broken machete. I have a butterfly knife in there. And I have a screwdriver that might poke you. Status over there? Uh, she's Still inside the, first the charger. Door now. Got a full pursuit. I mean, number two female. Got a purplish hair, a black tank top, black and white skirt. Keep on, keep on. I'm gonna hold on to this butterfly knife for now. Don't we'll resist it. After? Motorcycle is back. Someone else left me out. What were you doing at that house? Miss Cison. We were just looking at it. Has she been Mirandized? Yeah. Just You're just looking at houses? No resistance going south. She's yelling for help. There's a motorcycle pulling up right now. 
Is it pink? Yeah, she was over here by the pink cage. Now the ones got picked up northbound Volvo Park Drive. Me, uh, second, uh, third, third suspect wearing like a white baggy uh, baseball uh, jersey. For two female black masks pushing westbound. Volvo Park Drive left southbound off road toward Ellington. Southbound Ellington. Pink color Bati, I believe, motorcycle. Flowing or white westbound Clinton Avenue. That was what I was worried about. I saw her sitting over there. Bamboo Place. Antimeter Place. Poaching. Bamboo Boulevard. White westbound Bamboo Boulevard. Left southbound. I thought she'd come after us, though, rather than. Uh... I think her name is Zia. Maybe. I. Flowing left eastbound Haywick. I can never remember. Direction she went, Kutzixing northbound. What about these taser pongs? Do you want me to meet them? Or do you want to go about that? Yes. Please. Or do you want a professional? They're on my back. Please remove okay, them. Tessa, the last time oh I did this, I ripped them. Oh my god. You need help doing it? Yeah, I. Yeah, I okay. Last time I did it, I ripped out a bit too much skin. Oh god, okay. Um, well they told me to do it, so I did. I did warn them, uh, but they still, you know, for this time, I don't okay. want to... Okay, well, I, I'll a, go ahead and do it. positive pregnancy I, uh, test, I don't want to harm anything. What? Or anyone, yes. I'm yes. go ahead and get above you guys and watch above. Yes, so I am, took it's on you, Tessa. If she's okay. hurt, it's on you. I'm okay. Not, okay, how many times was she tased and where was, uh, the prop? one tase in the, uh, the right shoulder, the left shoulder, I think it was. Alright. Yeah, left, in there it is. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. Three, two, one, boom. There we go. Okay. Right. Feeling a little better? No, no. Our 95's phone was ringing, by the way. Uh, this, this 95, I saw her coming out of the house that was, uh, the alarm was going off. And the other girl who had purple hair, I believe I know her name, but I didn't get a positive ID. Uh, she was the one driving the motorcycle initially. Alright, copy that. So, if you got confirmation, hit it with, uh, burglary plus, uh, resisting. Watch your head. All right, thank you for the help. 429-76 MLPD-195. Copy that, good work everybody. Report you not to auto, it's vehicle maintenance. Ooh, my car. Oh no. Copy that. One auto here. Thank you, dispatch, I appreciate that. Gotta get this repaired. It did blow up yesterday, so I guess that's fair. Oh my god, Jonathan, I can't believe you would email someone under my name. Uh, how could you do this? Tessa knows it was you, by the way, based on the Cheeto dust left on the gosh dang keyboard.
Okay, and then the second name? Bell. B E L L E. Issa Bell. That O makes one name. Eh. Eh. Door. Also, she is a little bit different from the photo, so. I want to say her name is Zia. Let me see. Yep, that's her. I don't know if she was wearing a mask, though. I don't want to be that guy. I can't remember. <sighs> oh, okay, never mind. Okay, I'm good. Yeah, so she was insecure. Yeah, so she was insecure. Oh, okay. So she changed her appearance. She changed the color of her hair to... Um, this makes a lot of sense. Because of a ghost incident, I've had to sleep with multiple potatoes. I think he might be trying to get them as we usually play fetch with them. It just only bites me. That could be the motive. I'm not Appreciate sure. you taking the. She, she picked me up. Huh? <laughs> probably, probably not. Uh. <laughs> probably not. Okay. <laughs> I'm not Remember too these sure. foot checkers are just sitting around if you're not friendly with us. Okay. So, uh, how's Zia doing? Who's Zia? Oh, you know exactly who Zia is. Oh, I don't. What are you talking about? A likely story. I know who I saw. Hello. Oh, what are you up to, Game Warden? Processing a criminal. Ooh, okay. Uh, well, I was calling to see if you were rolling with anybody tonight. I am not. Would you like okay. to ride together? I would love to ride together. That sounds good to me because I apparently cannot drive. <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything, uh, but I, I may have heard a couple of shock expressions on the radio. <laughs> Listen, okay? I can't help it. I, uh, I crash and, you know, I do my best. Hey, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll crash and do our best together. I'll, uh, I'll swing by and pick you up. Okay. All right, I'll meet you in the cells. Okay, goodbye. Bye. Bundy just called me out. She gave us the name of the other person. It was it Isabel. Oh, she did? Yeah. Told her if she gave me a Isabel? name, I could not some extra time. Yeah. I-S-S-A space Bell. B-E-L-L-E. -L -L -E. I don't Let's think that's her. Reads. Oh, no, this is Winter Sison. Or Sison. No, she gave I, us the that's... Name not oh she also said i'm not gonna give her a warrant because i, I can't think she's giving a her. fake name i know exactly who the other girl was uh but i oh. i think she was wearing a mask so i can't really for sure say uh zia anna so she's lying to me i think she's trying to get this other person in trouble can they have a vendetta against her maybe possibly okay that or this was the girl on the pink motorbike? Hmm. 
Yeah, I'll ask that for the the rider of the main vehicle because I think this one, yeah, this one was definitely the passenger. Um, I mean, it could be. I'm not 100% sure. I didn't really get a good look on uh, how she looked, but she had dark hair. I know that for sure. Yeah. Um, but she did mention that. Hi, Tessa. She, before I even checked the, her profile, she said she what? may look different because she was insecure on how she looked. Wait, who is this? Hi, it's Jeffy. This is a doctor. The best day. Oh, no. Yeah, I got him. Okay. I got him. Uh, oh, Jeffy. Okay. Yeah, he did it. 30 months you got a weapons jail, license 60 for 60 months of parole. Oh, no, dude. He's getting wrangled. Uh, with three points added to your license. Which will be... You will my, have a total my of My license? Accomplice. I wasn't even driving. Well, you get an accomplice charge, which still, which still adds the uh, the driving points. Okay. Okay. Why are you negative? For okay. Uh, okay. If you could just uh, let me see your rest here real quick. Mm. You don't, you don't know. Thank here you. Go. Mm -hmm. uh, you'll get I sent up for 20 months. I'll take 10 months off. Did you have any priors, sir? Um, yeah, I do. Frankly, in the prosecutor expungement, the real kind of. Who's doing your uh, expungement? By the way, I'm not guilty. Okay? Well, Jeffy's getting wrangled. Bundy, I would love to have a conversation with you, if at all possible. No, I have nothing. Uh. I mean, yeah, we, we, we can chat. And... I'd just like to talk to, to, to Bundy one-on-one yeah, -on -one real quick, yeah. if I could. We can all three talk. I'd like to talk to, to, just, to just Bundy. Well, you can do that from jail. Jesus Christ. Where's Rosa? She's not answering, but I'm trying to get a hold of her. Okay. Uh, Wrangler, would you like me to try her while you're doing your paperwork and whatnot? No, I, I don't got too much. All right, sir. So okay. it's vandalism of government property. And, okay. Uh, possession of dirty money. All right. So, um, can you take these cuffs off me, please? Yeah, give me one second, sir. God. I feel like it's a rite of passage for almost any doctor or EMS to get wrangled at one point. Okay. You know, I wrangled an EMS not all that all, not all that long right. ago. That sucks, man. All you had to do was not commit crime. What happens now? Um, I'm, I would like to speak to a lawyer. All right. She's just not. She's just not answering. See, she calls. She uh, accepts it. Radio check. Uh, ten two. Following the bison eastbound for northbound strawberry. I'm trying to get you. I knew it. I knew it. He's just not answering. Yeah, well, I'm gonna... Four and five comms are going northbound strawberry avenue. Entering Legion Square. Is this, uh, is this part of the thing that you were yep. working on, Tessa? No. It was. He said, I'm running over Fingal. And then he did it. Uh, no, we had a mortel robbing a house. Oh. We had a lot of people robbing houses. This a little bit of form. Nice. Spun out. Or somebody get down to the crusade area. 
I was only here to get one. I'm gonna go there. Good slowing down. He's continuing southbound. BCB? Oh, he U turned. He's in the uh, canals 100%. In northbound in the canals, parallel right. little big horn cutting across. You're a ranger? Oh, yeah, he, he doesn't have an idea. Jesus Christ, speak. man. What do you mean, Jesus Christ? Right. Status? I mean, I'm Ocean King. Yeah, he exited on the popular. I didn't see what Yeah, northbound. Yeah, northbound popular. Oh, yeah. So yeah. I, just, I heard a voice yell, holy shit, and I saw it was you guys flying uh -huh. above me. What the hell was I getting? I got him westbound just above the canals off of popular. Yeah, no, that's a shake up. Train right? tracks. Are you always a moody bastard? You are what, officer? What? Continuous what southbound what? along the train tracks. What? You're talking to me? Getting left, what? getting back on the popular. Hey, that's a quick question. Hello. What am I supposed to like pay attention to? The city dispatch or the email dispatch? Because one says 49, the other one says 38. Is he still on the train track? Um. To be honest with you, I'm not sure. I, I don't really nice know. There's going out about the bot VCB, being like the main um, thing people like look at. I'm out on so a based on that, I was like, I can go 41. Then I, I get on duty, I look, and there's 48 people on the Yeah, I have no visual. I'm on the front of the corner out following that. Very confusing, you know? Uh, can I ask, so, uh, ask uh, Jimmy uh, what he says? Who do I got? Uh, I got yeah, maybe ask him because he, he might know a little better. And if okay. you could let oh, me know cool. if you find out, I don't doctor. actually know. Yeah, I'll let you know. I'll, I'll, yeah, I guess right. sounds good. I'll, Thank uh, you. Talk to you soon. Yeah, okay. I know. I know. All right. See you soon. Let me just take that off real quick. There, go. there you go, Jeffy. I never really know. <laughs> I don't know how much it's going to help, but. Um, I... All right. Let's... Sorry, I found it. That's what's happening here. I'm sorry. I'm trying to grasp. Position. What's up, special agent, director? To that little wallpaper with uh, measurements, and we can take a quick picture of you. Oh, right. yeah, hey, Betsy, yeah, what's here up? on the wall. Yep, yep. So you want to just go right there? It's perfect. Yep. Now just face me. Okay, yep. where you at? No, no, you want to face my way, my, my direction. Face. Yep. <laughs> Hold on a second. There we are. It's dark. No, no, in front of the, in front of the paper. In front of the measurements. Yep, yeah, let's have a Uh, Chumash. Uh, good, good luck, Jeffy. All the lights up. Yeah, uh, thanks, Bundy. Polino? Nope. You gotta be facing me. You gotta be facing me. Facing you? Oh, sorry, officer. I'm so sorry. Perfect. Perfect. That's what I need to do. Right? Oh, uh, okay. I think I know which one you're at. Okay, I'll have someone come and pick you up. Thank you for the compliment. All right. Okay, I'll be there to pick you up soon. Okay. All right, okay. See you soon. I'm going back out there. What? All right, good stuff. Thank you. Right. Well, I'm just, uh, I'm smell gonna go good, your don't worry. I don't want you sniffing me. You smell great, though. You smell like a beautiful blossom. Come on, Henry. Okay. Okay. So he switch. said, wait, wait. while getting oh. spiked and screaming in his car, well, yeah. um, the one in the city. I, I read somewhere that the one on the email chain is the one that people, you know, quote unquote, police. But, you know, for now, go off the city one, I suppose. Nice. Okay. Because that's what he said, right? Right. I'll try yeah. to find the message that I read before, right. and I can forward it to you as well. But yeah, for now, just go off city. So that's what he said, right? Kurt, you had a state. So I'm gonna okay. go 42, and uh, yeah, I'll just I'll wait. <laughs> All right. I'll be Sorry back. about that. No, 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 it's fine. It's not your fault. It's okay. Not my shift anyway, but yeah. All right, I'll I'll be out there. Okay. Bye. Bye. He said it. Him. He said it right there. Yup. Hi, right, pal, what are you in for? What did you do? Tell me. <laughs> Henry Clark? I killed people that look just like you, so shut your fucking mouth. Yeah, yep, you yep, fucking Henry dreams, Clark. lady. Uh, alright. How much do we need? to roll. Yeah. By me, Let's do it. By nine nice. men. Not a lot, but... Yeah. Yeah. I've got something special you in mind. You charge your guy. I was just about to say, I've got something special in mind <laughs> since I'm with the game warden. Her wheels haven't touched the pavement since uh, since Angel originally took her away from me. I'll be honest though, uh, with the uh, um, the only thing I don't like about the Taurus is how easily flippable it is.
No, I just had a, a house robbery. And... Uh, I saw... Zia Anna on a motorcycle come at me from up the hill. And then as she was doing that, another lady came out from the house and got on the motorbike. Uh, I was pretty sure it was Zia, but I, I didn't know if I could see her face or not. So I didn't want to hair ID somebody. Yeah, um, fair enough. And so we chased them around. We eventually got the one that came out of the house. And it was uh, winter season. And she got processed. And I, I got a text from a, mess, a number I didn't know. And it said, free her. And so I... Uh, I, <laughs> I told her... What? Uh, you really shouldn't abandon your girls like that, Zia. She trusted you. And then she... <laughs> She She's confirmed so her identity. She? Yeah. She said, I'm sending my lizard queef after you. And I know that Zia Anna has a, a lizard, an iguana named queef. Mm. Don't ask why. Yeah, I'm, I'm not and, going to. And, uh, she, <laughs> I told her, uh, you better be careful. I'm going to make sure queef gets a, a home that is somebody who doesn't put him in danger. And then she said, OMG, LOL, sorry, my sister hacked my phone. Sorry about her, Tessa, she's crazy. Don't worry, I'll tell her off. Thanks for doing your job. <laughs> Good lord. So anyway, we caught one of them. That's good. You see that bison up there doing drifties? I did not, but now I see it. Yeah, I bet we can sneak up on him a little bit and... Harms, thank you for the, the 55 oh, months. Stop, stop, Welcome stop, back. Baby, sons of bitches. Was it this guy? Yeah. Yeah, that's the guy. Yeah. Probably looked in his rearview mirror and saw us creeping up on him. I was hoping if we only cleared the intersections that we might be able to sneak up behind him. So what, uh, you not a big fan of the Chargers, Tessa? Nah, they're too loud and... I don't know, I just prefer other vehicles. I will say, for the mountains, I prefer the Explorer. Um, yeah. Mostly because we don't really need S class up there, so I usually swap when I go back up in the hills. Um, but uh, for in city, I I don't know. I like them quite a bit. I'll be honest, the CVPI kind of grew on me after a while. The CVPI is actually un underrated. weirdly enough. Yeah, actually underrated. It's, um, it's like late end acceleration isn't great, but for in-city stuff, the, the early acceleration on it is so darn good. I'm sorry, gunshot. I'm from somewhere northbound over here. Oh, there it is. that call have a A45 AM okay, an AMG all right why do all these new cars sound like guns that's a good question if i told you i had an A45 AMG you would probably think i had a rifle uh, most likely and i also wouldn't know what kind of car that is the only reason I know if he told I, me it was a car. Yeah, the only the only reason I know is because the, the the AMG and the R34 seem to be some of the most popularly chased vehicles we have now. Those are the only two I can name for you. That 
sussy. Driving around with no doors. Carlo Robinson. Parked in the middle of the road. Dispatch 251 out with an abandoned bike off of Boulevard Del Perro. Uh, oh. Well, that's interesting. When I ran the VIN through my uh, through my MDW, it's not reporting this to the government, Tessa. Wait, what? When I ran the VIN on this bike, uh, uh, dispatch came back to me. Can't find anything on this vehicle. Not good. Report this to the government. Oh, God. I thought we were the government. What the hell? <clears throat> I'm the government. Oh, I gosh. need to look yeah. at this. Yeah, it's like, take a. <laughs> Wait, what? I don't know. It doesn't doesn't have signs of force break in or anything. It's just. So I think I know what the issue is here. What do you think it is? This is uh this is a motorbike. Oh, are you saying These it's too cringe a... to have a VIN number? Yep. Mm. Yeah, Definitely a motorbike that is cringe. Yep. Well, I'll, I'll get this thing. Yeah, we got, a, we got a motorbike over here being cringe. We got to get this. Uh... Ah. I, d I don't actually know what to do with this, to be honest. Yeah, I don't, I'm going to be honest. I, I think I this, this used to happen from time to time. I just haven't seen it in a while. Old cars be. I don't know. Should just Sierra impound that one, maybe? I don't know. Huh. Oh, I'm sure it's okay. I think we just leave it here for now. Yeah, it's just a little carbon. Ain't no big deal. Uh, did we have a 77 request on this frequency? Well, I, if we can have hey, people from, post... Uh, transitioning channel 2. Alright. How long have you been on shift, Tesla? Admittedly not very long. I'm just a little uh a little, little wonky and I don't know why. Well, do you, uh, did you have a long shift yesterday? Yeah. yeah sometimes I didn't good. sleep great either. Three twenty three, one ninety five. It's kind of that time of year, honestly, you know, uh, the heating up and cooling down and all that. Yeah. Keep it on, monkey, 10, 7, 12, 20. That's what so did you find me. out what uh, Jeffy was arrested for? Um, He had him on vandalism of government property and possession of dirty money. The possession of dirty money is... Sweet that one's kind of obvious. I'll be back um, the um, I assume he had a couple of rolled up bills on him after he got popped, but 
The vandalism, I got no idea what he actually did. However, because uh, Wrangler and I are the same rank, I wasn't really going to question him. I was just, you know. Uh, 242 should be on channel 3 responding to a 1080 from shots fired. I am curious, though. I wonder why he had dirty money. Mm, I know that uh, I know they go fishing and stuff quite a bit, and sometimes you can pull up those treasure chests and whatnot. Um, obviously, a responsible citizen would turn that type of stuff in immediately or otherwise dispose of it. But two nineteen from dispatch, they are requesting seventy-seven from on channel one. It's going to be a ten eighty from a thirty-one alpha. Two five one on frequency. Where do you need us? Um, I don't know. I mean, honestly, Tessa, the, the doctors have been wilding. Uh, I jokingly told Lennon the other day that I, I think the doctors need a squish, but... Uh, she she got on duty the other day, and within 20 minutes of her being on duty, one of the attendings at the hospital told her how to make lean. How to make lean? Yeah, how to make lean. Cool. <laughs> okay. Put up on Palomino? Um, yeah. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I don't know. She got to work and she literally... No she noticed that the uh, Sprunk machine was selling soda. Uh, so she asked about it. And... And then as soon as she asked about it, a doctor told her, oh yeah, you can get some of that and mix it with the cough syrup to make lean. I swear to God, we... Where are the comms? the process of getting clean outlawed um i am still waiting on one of the medical reports that i need but i have uh i've actually got a draft that i can share with you uh once we're out of chasing a bicycle. What are we looking at? Uh, well, uh, if you're asking about this, we were looking at the report that we were writing for the mm, last can incident. I can make it up this. I can. Haha. <laughs> I was involved. Be advised, multiple 1071s is going to be on We're on channel one and we're looking for a bicycle. Plus it's cheddar. Um... I've got a draft that I can send over to you, though. I've started uh, compiling some of the currently? reports. Um, okay. and, heading up towards Drive. and I received one of the medical reports the that I need to add in there, but I'm waiting for the second one, basically the the section where we talk about the uh, dangerous effects and whatnot. Is he uh, down in the... currently uh, covering over the Del Perro freeway for you. It's going to be in the canal um, by the Mayor Park entrance, going in circles. Oh, he is? Okay. Confirm. Spin around down there. I don't know. Uh, the lean there, thing, it's... Oh, it's just somebody else on a bike. Like, I'm kind of scared to step on people's toes with it, Wait, because I know that the SDSA is him. also investigating it. Um... Kind of looks like Hawk. Lean switched. 
I mean, Silas yep. was telling me the other day about uh, the Lean it, Task Force like that, that he uh, has open or something. Gray t-shirt, black uh, beanie. But at the same time, I'm not sure that I really trust their work, to be honest with you, because he was telling me about how they, like, gonna, test, a, test the product to test out. the purity of it or something. Or so... Or yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say that's not how that should be doing. Yeah, I mean, uh, that I, we don't normally do that with, like, cocaine or anything. I, I guess in the 80s, I put a little on your gums or something, but... Yeah, we, well, we need to get it out loud as soon as we can. can I, I, I don't know what they're doing with it, but I don't particularly care that much. And I have one of if the they're going to complain about us uh, stepping on toes, then well, really if they've had this going fine. for as long as they have, and and haven't even considered getting uh, legislation well, put in, break I, off. He's I don't really know what to say. Shirt, black beanie. He's going east. Oh, sorry, southbound went off road down to the freeway westbound Del Perro freeway. He is now heading. Hey, McFluffin, how's it going? Bound San Andreas Ave. I turtled. I can't follow. With this SUV that's coming up uh, Glory Way right now. I have no idea what we're chasing right now. The com, uh, it seems like it's a bicycle with a lot of interference vehicles. <laughs> but they lost the bicycle and now they're not chasing the interference vehicles? I don't, I don't really know what's going on with this call. I hear Let's the check. bike heading towards MRPD. I'm in the tunnels what's, underneath. What's his legal name? Uh, or Shutter, visual. Shutter's legal West name Mountain. is Carlos Sanchez. Maintaining westbound San Andreas approaching Legion. Ooh. I'm doing good. Really tired. I'm trying to get my energy back. Just, uh, you know, it's going to be a minute. Uh, so there's that. That's what I've, that's what I've cobbled together so far on it. Um... Lennon is actually going to write the other medical report because the actual doctor <laughs> You're so who, was about it. It, who was actually the same doctor who told her how to make lean <laughs> uh, failed to write her report <laughs> so now Lennon has to write it uh, Nice Yeah Nope, oh, yep, there's the, the, cool, there's the bicycle pursuing Why are we pursuing him? Uh, 31 Alpha, and they had two interference vehicles, a red truck, and something else. Okay. Can you run? Yes. Oh, okay. And apparently he's doing an oxy run. <laughs> of course he is. <laughs> I mean, it's Sounds cheddar, like cheddar, so it makes sense. Just like, don't get me too close to him because he might try to make me do the oxy. Oh, is that a thing you guys have? Yeah, he's trying to make me do every kind of drug. Mm, so, okay. I'm actually surprised he hasn't gotten me with Lean yet. You know, Cheddar, uh, Cheddar and I used to, uh, the way that I met him was he was part of Eastside Beat Gang. And he would show up and randomly beat all of the dispatchers with baseball bats. Oh, God. Yeah. So eventually I started arming the dispatchers and we fought back. Him Avenue. and Eugene were not prepared for that. Yeah. He, um... He got me with LSD. And he got me with back, cocaine. You guys have three. Uh, I overdosed on that, by the way. Um... And then... He also got me with, uh... What's it? The... The canisters, the NOS canister. He made me huff one of those. Jesus. That just gave me a headache. We can't follow here. There's a staircase. Sounds kind of like just, going around. Sounds like inhaling here. Yeah, it's, it's for the rat stuff that we yeah. really need you, honestly. Yeah, once we get back on them, you're good to just sit back for parallels. I'm gonna like, stay on Glory Way to see if I can actually get a visual from this side. Yeah, yeah Reed got Bridge me Street. with metamorphine. Uh, he is heading still. Uh, old Jocko Romano got me with that. 
But then I got him with terror. So, you know. Yeah, he's on the yeah. dirt path. Oh, he just jumped <laughs> off and down. Back on the canal. We have a lot of units on this. Yeah, and they don't have any of the We're interference vehicles in the Tell either. Are there any remaining interference vehicles on this? No, they broke off, so we can have people break off. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and do that. We're still going down through the canals. Looks like he's gonna try to jump over. We'll stay on radio popular. just in case they come back. Tracks, yeah, yeah, we'll get a little gas here. Thank you, breaking off. Thank you for the backup, guys. Thank you. And southbound through the canals. Oh. Left. Yeah, I don't know why that was such a popular uh, thing when people, uh, I swear, when metamorphine first hit the streets, everybody was just running around stabbing people with needles. All right, it's not popular. Yeah, that was the worst one for me, I think. Try to do the jump under the freeway. Yeah, he's probably yeah, gonna that, do that. When that happened to me, uh, we can block I apparently him off, stole a police so charger anywhere. and then oh, got on an like ATV a and out ran three interceptors and air one. Oh, oh god! <laughs> Funny enough, if I if I remember correctly, everything was a little hazy, but I think it might have been Wesley who convinced me that the police were trying to get me. Alright, I'm, I'm on the roof already. Oh, hold on, I'm being a phone guy. Hello. Hi, Tessa. It's Charlotte. Hi, Charlotte. Um, do you have a second to talk? Oh, uh, what about? Oh, uh, well, I just took a report from someone in MRPD who says an off-duty officer shot him uh, because he was shooting at a rat that was on his shoulder, and so this guy shot him and his rat. All right, I'll get back. I'll get to the roof he was on. And I don't really know what to do with this information. Um, I, I'm sorry, so an off-duty officer saw someone with a rat on their shoulder, and instead of, I don't know, maybe doing something reasonable, they shot the individual's rat? Yes. That was and in doing so, they accidentally, yeah, Where shot this? this man, and then he, um, passed out from blood loss. Okay, which officer was it? Um, probably Winston Walker. Um, the guy doesn't know for what? sure, but he did hear the name Winston. And then the, um, EMS he talked to afterward said that Winston Walker was there, so... He has an officer. It might have been Winston Walker, but I there's have no, a hard like, time for sure... Winston would do that. Yeah, but... there's no for sure proof about it, oh, but that's kind of what this guy's making it sound like. Okay. Um, I'm, uh, where are you? Where, where's the guy? I'm at MRPD, and I think that guy is still in the waiting room out front. Okay, mission row. I have, like, a projectile encasing that I can process. Yeah, if you, if you could m have him wait, I would like to come and talk to him. Yep, sounds good. I'll tell him right now. Thank He's you, He's also Charlotte. waiting for bass for something unrelated, I think, so he okay. should be out there. All right. Okay, bye, Tessa. Thank you, bye-bye. Okay, That seems kind of wild for gun? Winston. I cannot imagine him doing that. Winston wants to be a ranger too, so I, I cannot imagine what I would do if one of my rangers shot a rat off of someone's shoulder. Yeah, I mean, short of it being a bubonic rat, but it was nibbling on their ear or something. You know, the yeah. Not a lot of excuses for that. Uh, he's saying that he does not have. Uh, he does have an officer over his shoulder right now. Not only did he so shoot the rat, by. but he also shot the person whose rat it was, so. Um, if we can find a location while you grab statements, I can try to get to where it was to document anything. I think Charlotte... He is, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was in the oh, MRPD uh, waiting room. And also... Oh, I forgot. Um, Sheila Winston, would, saw one it. Down low with you? And she said it have one down here with me. was Winston. We have EMS on something. I'm going to catch him if they drive. Don't worry. What? Uh, hold, hold on for a second, guys. Oh, good lord. 
so maybe talk to her about it. Um, right. okay. I haven't gotten her to give me a statement statement yet, but um, I'm going to go add the evidence really quick, so it's in the report. Bundy, would you mind getting that statement? Yeah, I'll get that statement. Uh, good good work, Sweatballs. Get the... Uh, get the uh, get the uh, Okay, yeah, guess he's not surrendering. Charlotte was picking up his bike. Hey, look, you know, if you he like your name, that's what it is. Hello. Okay, here, shots fired. What happened? Multiple Fulton? Oh, are, uh, you, are, you, are you the Tessa lady that uh, Charlotte I, I am, you? yes. I, I would like to know kind of what occurred. Goodness gracious. Oh, about, about the man shooting me, yes. Um, yeah. Well, I'll tell you exactly what I told her. Uh, a few officers, one that looked like a Chicago, like, 50s cop, you know, from, like, a black and white film walkthrough. Uh, sounded like he was from Boston. Uh, he was talking up a storm to a lady, uh, and with purple hair, then they punched, then they punched him, and then the, and then the man who shot me walked in, uh, said some stuff about his genitalia. Uh, about how uh, it, he's he's packing it, or no? That was the man. Uh, can can Sorry. you slow down, please? I'm trying to write oh, this. Yes, I can. Yes, I can slow down for That's, you. It's all right. Where, so where, you, where, where were you, up to? you were here. A few officers yes. were in the lobby. One yes. looked like he was from like an old noir film, and he sounded yes. like he was from Boston. Yes, very uh, nasally, kind of like me. Nasally. Yes. Um, there was one in purple, purple hair, had like sweatpants, sweat jacket on. Uh, and then a man who shot me walked in, uh, with like, like, uh, polyester joggers, polyester jacket. Sort of looked like he was about to go for a jog, had black hair, sunglasses. I think someone said his name was Winston. Don't really remember. My head, my head was killing me. He was uh, wearing but... polyester jacket. Yes, kind of like, kind of like Adidas fit where you know what if you know what I'm talking about I think ah uh, it's kind of hard to you know it's all jumbled you know getting shot point blank ah uh, but I was sitting here and then the the 50s cop uh, started antagonizing him about his genitalia size he said he was packing ah uh, and then he then he said he wasn't uh, and then I snickered about that, and then he looked over at me, screamed, rat, rat, you know, the one that's on my shoulder presently, uh, and then be began to open fire on my shoulder. Unprovoked. And then, uh, he didn't quite incapacitate me, I walked forward, I was on my, I was on my ass, you know, uh, switching in pain. Wincing in there, you know, swelling all about the place, bleeding everywhere. I screamed for an ambulance, and then I fell unconscious. And I woke up in the hospital. Doctor saved my rat and myself. Uh, and then uh, I got the name of the EMS. I believe they saw it as well. The the EMS witnessed the incident. Uh, well, they they witnessed uh, the man who did it. Apparently, I see. Okay. Uh, who was the EMS? Uh, James Rue? James Rue. Rue, I think R-O-O. -O. I am unsure. And what is, uh, what is your name? Uh, my name's Reginald. Reginald Copper Popper. Pleasure to meet you. Reginald Copper. Copper. C-O-P-P-E-R like the metal. Popper, P A U P E R. Like police officer. Popper, popper, okay. Yes. All right. Um, and did you get your rat seen by a vet? Uh, apparently, one of the doctors was a vet. What? I forget her name. Okay. She was very lovely. Okay. What? Now, here, here's what I'm going to recommend to you, okay? Make sure that you get uh, a veterinary report and the report for your medical uh, treatment from the hospital. We may actually need that in the future. Um, All right. Uh, I could go back down to the hospital and uh, see if the doctor's still there. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. I'm sure it's fine. I hope that's not my car. 
Uh, okay. Yeah, I was actually waiting for Mr. Oh god, what was his name again? Ah. Uh, trooper, bold, name like a fish. Bass? Yes, that, that's the one, thank you. Ah, uh, yes, I was waiting for him because I need to discuss with him uh, about a business agreement I was going to try and do with the rental lot. All right. Yeah, he was right here. He was talking to another officer, I think. And then I'm related, but that's why okay. I was here in the first place. Pull the gun on him. I will. Uh, I will look into the situation and figure out what exactly went wrong. Uh, it sounds like he may have been off duty if this occurred when he was in his fitwear. Um, yes, he wasn't dressed like an officer, but they said he was. One. I see. Okay. All right, I'm going to get this taken care of. Wonderful. Thank you so much for all your help. It, uh, it may be that you might need to uh, testify in court if it comes to that. So we'll be in touch. We'll let you know no, if we need no you, okay? No problem. I will definitely be looking for civil suit as well. Don't worry. Okay. I appreciate all your time all right. there, Miss Thank you very Tessa. much. Of course, uh, I'm going to get to the hospital to get that veterinarian report. Uh, All right. We'll Thank take you. Care now. Make Thank sure you, you get the doctor's name as well. Of course, yes. No, I need to get their... I need to get their call sign number. Wait. Oh, God. Okay, now I, need, I can see who it is now. Let me ask Maya. Yes? Maya, uh, you... in the room? Hello? 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 Oh, there you are. Oh, Sorry, I didn't know you were there. Just stuck up on me. I, I, I needed to, uh, could, could I procure your phone number so I may call you, uh, about this? There you go. And it's, uh, so Tessa much. Lamb. Tessa Lamb, thank you so much. All right, four, one, five, six, oh, five, nine, two, seven, six, zero, five. Yes, uh, my blood and viscera was spread all across this, this building, of course, so, uh, you might want to get that cleaned up. I thank you. And a good one. Mm, I still see a little bit of blood here. Not sure if it's the same. I'll snap a picture real quick. Oh boy. Yep. Tessa! What the heck just happened? He uh, kicked me off my over. bike! Why? I don't know, because I fucked his mannequin. Yeah. Dickhead, that's what you get. Sorry, you can't just kick people for I saying was stuff. My wife. No, I didn't just say it. I actually fucked his mannequin wife. Okay, I'm well. Out of your bed. He neglected he her. Up, man. Willie, he kept Willie. her in a bathtub all Just alone all the time. I don't know. This seems like a crime of passion. I don't know. There's really much yeah, yeah. I think I'm good. And, yeah. All right. Let's go talk about this. Yeah. Let's compare notes. Uh, hey, uh, Sweatbox, do you remember uh, yeah. who the other officer in the lobby was? Oh, I was asking her. That, but oh, I well, I wasn't remember. here for any of it. Um, Reginald said that it was someone with purple hair. But purple. I, that doesn't really ring a bell for me. Yeah, that doesn't sound familiar to me either. Um. I don't know myself either. I can't think of anybody with purple hair. Pilbus? Was it with... Was he talking to Pilbus? I think it was a lady with purple so? hair. Yeah, he said it was a woman. Do we have any purple-haired officers? Not that I can think of off the top of my head. Uh, Crystal? Oh, yes, actually. Um, I've always thought of hers as like a dark blue, but I guess you could see, see a purple there. Yeah, it's... Yeah, kind of hard to tell sometimes. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't know for sure. But what we need to focus on now is make sure that you don't you don't have too much drug. All right. Well, let's uh, let's go compare note. Let's see what we're working with on this. Okay. All right. Um, do you want to tell me what yeah. Copper Popper had? All right. So basically, uh, he said there were a few people in the room in the the lobby there. One looked like he was uh from an old noir fifties film, like black and white cop film, uh, and sounded like he was from Boston. Uh, and also kind of nasally. One was a female with purple hair, sweatpants, and a jacket. Um, and then there was the, the man who shot him. He walked in. He was wearing a polyester jacket slash, like, Adidas fitwear. Uh, and he said that someone mentioned his name was Winston. The uh, 50s noir cop started antagonizing uh, the person he thought was Winston. Uh, about his penis size, and Winston defended his penis size, and then he turned and saw the rat, started screaming, rat, rat, and opened fire. Um, and then he got shot alongside the rat. Uh, the rat seemed injured. Uh, it looked like he'd been shaved after, like, surgery. He said that he screamed for an ambulance and fell unconscious, and, uh, EMS came... To the scene and uh that ems he said he got the name of afterwards uh james rue okay Interesting his name notes. is uh reginald copper popper okay um so Sheila's version of events was somewhat similar. She didn't overhear the preceding conversation, but she did say she heard individuals speaking in the lobby. Uh, stepped out into the goldfish bowl, like not fully into the lobby, but into the reception area. Um, at that time, uh, Winston Walker had been speaking with another officer, uh, turned and shouted, oh my God, it's a rat. Pulled out a firearm uh, and fired a shot uh, towards the man's shoulder. Um, Sheila said that then they... Uh, so Sheila turns and goes <laughs> to go into the uh, bullpen to tell Maya what's going on. Um, steps back up to the door and sees... Copper Popper swinging on Winston, who then walks out of the door. Um, Sheila then goes fully through, sees Copper Popper crying in pain. They call for EMS. Um, there was also a 911 uh, around that time requesting an officer to come to MRPD and collect evidence, which I have documented that. Um... And then around the time they called EMS, Winston walked back through the glass doors, at which time Copper Popper passed down. So, I mean, pretty much the same story, just from a different angle. Yeah, he just texted me and said that Lennon was the one who treated him and the rat, so. Okay. Uh, let Boy, me... this is awkward. Yeah. Let me it's a whole, uh, family triangle, ain't it? Board. Goodward knows, thank you for the 33 months. Welcome back. Okay, um, I've notified her that we're going to end up requesting that report. I mean, what in the hell? What? I guess we what gotta, would I guess possess we, him I, to do that? I don't know. I, I guess we got to call him and get him down here, though. 
because if he's got a firearm on his person that's a match for those casings in the lobby and he doesn't have any explanation whatsoever to what just happened, I mean, he's going to have bigger problems than the whole ranger thing, I think. Has he uh, been picked up by any of the departments? Not to the best of my knowledge, but he's also... Um, he was undergoing uh, surgery the last time he texted me. Um, 14 days ago, going into surgery, consultation starting, 95% chance of survival. So I, I think he's been... I don't know, uh, ICU, physical therapy, whatever, uh, after that. Well, he called me within the last hour and talked to me about the ranger stuff. And uh, he didn't sound like he was not okay. Uh, I'll be honest, I think the next step is to call him to Mission Road to have a conversation with him, maybe not let him know what we want to talk about. Uh, that way he doesn't have a chance to dispose of any firearms. Um, at which point we can detain him and document the firearm that he has on his person. And we got to get a statement from him, figure out what his side of the story of this is, because that this does not look good, Tessa. No. Do we have to read him as Garrity warning or just his Miranda rights? Uh, depends on the direction. Sounds like he was off duty. It. Yeah, I mean, if he was off duty and we're just kind of going the criminal investigation direction, uh, Miranda supersedes Garrity. All right. I don't know. That's uh, that's up to you, High Command. If you <laughs> if you want to use this strictly as something that we're uh, basing hiring decisions on, uh, then we can uh, we can do Garrity. But if we're looking at this as both choosing uh, hiring and firing and potential criminal stuff, then we'll we'll want to go with Miranda instead. Well, for me, my default is usually criminal charges, but uh, all right, let's uh, let's get him down here. Okay, you want to call him, or you want me to? Uh, if you would like to. Yeah, on duty right now. Probably not. I guess it's outside of ship. Uh, well, he is not picking up. All right. Then, if that's the case, I don't know if he's still awake. Uh, we might have to do this tomorrow, but I will go ahead and document everything. I'll mention it in the proper channels, and then figure out where to go from there. But we'll need to get him in for an interview, I think. Yeah, I'm genuinely curious as to what his side of this is. Um... I don't know. I, I feel like I've seen, uh, I don't know. Uh, it's odd that he would be having a conversation with somebody and then just skate off and do something like this. It's, it's also, not characteristic of him, is it? No, it's, well, yes and no. I mean, last time that he was accused of doing something like this, it was in relation to his family, right? I mean, hell, he was protecting Morris. Um... 
and between you, me, and the brick walls, I kind of backed them on that one. Uh, this is a little more wild. We got somebody knocking on the doors trying to talk to us. I think that's my gesture. Right. I have a uh, investigative report made. If you want to put the evidence in there, um, there was one already made for oh, the was to go by Charlotte. Well, mm -hmm. oh, oh, I'm blind. Well, I'm a little stupid. All right, hold on. Hey, Ripley. Uh, yeah, actually, uh, Tessa and I are at a MRPD in the uh, captain's office. If you can come over here, I've got uh, just one quick thing to share with you. All right. Uh, I've got the, I've got Sheila's statement in there already. Let me get the photograph in. I'm also going to call Charlotte and make sure she gets the stuff into the locker for that. And... Hey, Sweatbox, what's going on? Um, hey, we've got, uh, make sure you get that evidence into that locker for me, okay? Oh, hell yeah. All right, you're the best. Nope, that's all. All right. All right, the photo is in there. Fairfield statement is in there. All right. Hey, well. Good Lord. This sucks. <laughs> yeah, I don't like this at all. Uh, I need to chat with Ripley briefly, but uh, but oh. you're welcome to tag along. Uh, okay. Tessa, could I borrow you for a second? Uh, sure. It's really quick. They told me to come talk to you. Oh. Okay. Um, Ripley, let's take the uh, let's take the, the old BTS off. Sure. Um, I'm placing a docket for drug trafficking for Z Davis, and I can't find his um proper like, you know. Oh, is uh. Yeah, I I have one, but it's not. What government website there? thing? Yeah, I can't find it, and I've looked everywhere. So I don't want to put it through if I don't have it, you know? What's his uh, name? Uh, Z Davis. Z-E-E-D-A-V-I-S. And I have his state ID as well. Uh, his state ID is 32496. This is all that I needed you for. I just can't figure it out. Sometimes it's even hard for me to, uh... Oh, 
Oh my god. Um, I might have to get back to you on that one. Okay, am I okay to just send it through without it, or? Uh, for now, yes. Uh, you'll want okay. to make sure you get that properly put in there, though, on, on a separate thing. Okay. Uh, once you find out what it is. Uh, give me a second, though. I'll, I'll make sure I figure out who it is. Well, this makes me feel a little bit better because I thought I was just an idiot. No, sometimes it's uh, a little harder than others. Yeah. Even even I have trouble sometimes. Uh. Try one more thing. Do I put like a little note on it or do I just send it as is? Uh, just say pending. Okay. All right. Thank you. No problem. Sorry, I don't have it immediately. I'll get oh, that to you, okay. though. This is the first time I've posted one of these, so I was like, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Yeah, no worries. Just put um, what you have and anything that you're missing, like evidence, um, reports, things like that. Doctors, uh, reports, autopsies. Uh, it, it's fine if it's not there in the initial post. Okay, what you'll need fine. to do is just follow up as soon as you can. And make okay. sure that you get that stuff done in a timely manner. Okay, sounds good. Thank you for your help. Yeah, no problem. Just try to make sure it gets done ASAP. Um, obviously, you're waiting on me, so don't worry. I'll make sure you're helped. But it's in my little queue of things, so I'll just wait to figure out what that is. Okay, thank you, Tessa. No problem. So if I can follow that up with the next call with, uh... Oh, hey, Tessa. With, uh, the, uh, the clown man, then, uh... Oh. Yeah, It'd be once, good. I will uh, tug at that string. Yeah, once once you have subpoenaed other information, let me know. I can route it through our uh, third-party service that we use to uh, triangulate all this stuff. Um, so if you okay. end up pulling anything for uh, uh, for our clowns or anything else, then we'll uh, we can create something similar within the time frame. You know, definitely. Which actually brings up a good uh, a good point, uh, Tessa. You are around this time of day i might need some subpoena stuff signed from a command member but i also know that you have uh, a good relationship with the clowns uh how do you feel about me coming to you if i need some paperwork signed to try to get their records searched oh that's fine okay yeah as long, i mean so long as you're not violating their rights i don't i have no issue Okay, yeah, it's probably meant to make you feel I any literally, better. It would likely be with their permission. I literally anyway, but... signed a search warrant for Kirk Jerkums the other day. No issue. 
Was that the one that got his meth tables found? Yes. What an idiot. I've been waiting for something like that to happen to him, because he always hints at it. He always, you know, jokes around about it. But, you know, it's just a matter of time. Yeah. Apparently they caught him out in broad daylight under under the big blue sky, just cooking some <laughs> meth on the table. Yeah. Not, what, not Sounds 20 like yards a... away from his front door of his house. No, that's Fuck, that's I... totally fine. Um, I have no issue signing off on a warrant if it's a, a valid warrant. That's, I mean, mm -hmm. nothing's going to affect that for me. I just, uh, I just had a revelation. A revelation? Well, hit me, brother. Um, I bet he used that phone to call Jatterbox to have him pick up the GPS locator that was placed onto Lennon. I bet they You're were both, right. They, they probably were, had to put it on her yeah. when they took her, so I I'll have to get a full... The same location, yeah. I'm not going to let Chatterbox know one iota of any of this. I'm going to act like the dumb cop who just came in and is just starting to try to clue things together in this case. I want to see how much or how little he he gives me not knowing that I know this. So if he, without me telling him, if he volunteers that he went to that location, picked up a GPS locator without me prompting him, tells me that he then was told to go get the Sanchez's, go get Lennon at the hospital and then drive her, I think that's a really solid link. I am inclined to agree. I'm going to try to, as with any case, lean heavily that it's great for him to tell me this stuff, but I need some kind of guarantee that he's going to testify to it in court. Because him saying it, they could weasel out of it, but him testifying in court, that's all of a sudden, that's, that's, that's evidence all of a sudden. All right, uh, Tessa. You're trying to read what they say. This guy, this guy right here. This What's guy. um? She's engrossed with her phone. These kids. I'm, I'm sorry. Go ahead. I, I was listening. I'm sorry. I um got some uh, some word back up the uh, from the flagpole, and uh, I put your name forth as the first uh, canine certification. And it just got the green light. So uh, as of this moment, you are officially uh, canine certified. Well, congratulations, oh Tessa. <laughs> I'll be right back. I have been standing here for just a lot of minutes. I need to right walk really in front of your photo. That's okay. okay. We're just reading the bulletin. Yeah. Wait, there's bull is there new ones? Uh, I don't know. Welcome aboard, Scout. Good boy. Oh, God. Hey, uh, hey, Tess, I heard you were in my office. Don't shoot the rat. Do not shoot that guy or the rat. I me. swear to God, if over. another person shoots that rat. Hey, listen, don't worry. I'm taking so the shootable. I'm taking the complaint. Yeah, it's like a little oh, target. good, actually. All right, All right thank you. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, you <laughs> Fred. You snuck up on me. You snuck up on, on me. Head is like, how Reginald, okay. Ren Reginald, it's all right. I got a game warden here. He, uh... He already spoke with me about this. Um, oh, he said he wanted to talk to the colonel. Oh, okay. Uh, Wrangler's calling me real quick. Heard you were in my office, by the way, Tessa. I don't appreciate that. You should always ask before going into my office. Oh, your office? Going on. This one? This office? Your office? The one that says Sam Bass on it? That's interesting. Uh, 
told you that's the one I was talking about. If we get to the point where we I don't know. I'm probably just gonna pretend to listen to what he says and fake getting a recording together. The game wardens in front of me. I can't. Do me a favor, zoom. Just gun point blank at my rat again. Let's get together in a in a bit. Just anyway. All right. Um. So how you feeling, Tessa? How how are you coming into being the game warden? With the well, so far so Maybe good. You know, I've had a little bit of issue, but I heard your high command of the PD, and I heard that uh, Kiki huh. Pendragon's high command of the EMS. You guys are a real power no way, couple. You're inferring. You're inferring no, from me. You're just no. guessing. Um, words look like I mean, words. I guess so. You guys still together? Yeah. Why? Uh, why? Pretty sure I proved in court that she uh, ocean dumped herself. What? Why are you dredging up all this old news? Why you gotta be like this? <laughs> be like what? What? Every time you talk to me, you try to agitate me. Why? No, I don't try to agitate you. Look, uh, you... Tessa. All right, I, uh, oh, sorry, Game Warden. Um, you know, I used to be your boss. I'm proud of you. Thank oh, you. Oh, God! I should be the commissioner! <laughs> One of these uh, days, I'm gonna be your boss again. It's all right. Sad watching someone just lose their and, uh, Yeah, I'm good. Anyway, don't worry, uh, don't worry. I'll make sure to take care of you when I'm in charge of the PD. Yeah, I'm sure take you care will. Take any baby squirrels lately? No, just a rat over here. Okay. Mm, yeah, yeah. I've been, uh, been talking there. to him. He's an ugly fucker, but he's got a lot to say. I don't- I don't know how I feel about an officer shooting him, though. Yeah, well, I don't know how I, I feel about it either. I think the three of us gotta step into my office. Alright. Hey, 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 hey. Whoa. Oh, Fred, oh, there's people already in here. Fred. Hey, I'm not sure if you guys know, but this is Kyle uh, Fred's office. Yeah, These are all wow. my boxes. Is this where all the, the, he's, he's the victory the, cases go? The, the, the ones well, really Ripley, I, I, I'm okay with I'm okay with sharing it with you, Ripley. I want you to oh, know that okay. I've always respected you. But keep Absolutely. your eye on Bundy. He's investigating rabbits. Rabbits. Yeah, I'm, well, I'm also investigating. I'm, I've also already started investigating the guy that you're about to talk to. Oh God, I need a drink. Wait. Yeah. Oh dear. Is everybody investigating right. me? Yeah, everybody's that is, that is a rat investigating on his shoulder. you. I thought I was seeing things. Unless you did something wrong. I don't did think you I do did. something wrong? No. I mean, like, are you? It sounds that's spoken like somebody who did. <laughs> are you sure you didn't? Jesus Christ! Are you sure you didn't kidnap any cartoon, cartoon dogs? Or I need to see how to be truth serum. serum. Barbara cartoon. What? What is this? Sure, pick here. Grab this truth serum. Oh, strong is it? What the fuck is this? Yeah, go ahead and just give that a chug. We're oh gonna get God! The, we're gonna get the, the whole story out of you. Why does that guy look, look like Freddy Krueger crossed with like a elementary school magician? Oh, I was thinking he looked like that. He looks like the guy who had the dog who laughed all funny in the cartoons. Uh, no, he kind of looks like a nutsack with a top hat on. Yeah, well, yeah, a bowler cap or whatever that is. He's got socks and sandals on. He's trying to tell us about fashion. I almost stole my shoes, you asshole. I couldn't get them back because nobody can get them back for me. You should be He's barefoot. I'll tell though. you the truth now. I've, I've done my job. Ah, well Shot done. you. <laughs> Right, some some guys wearing like a weird tracksuit. All right, it was a man. Yeah. You know, it was ninety percent of the. So so that's like ninety percent of the PD. Wait, Winston Walker shot you. That's who they said it was. I don't know. What's in your storage God. in your apartment right now? Not not much. Got any drugs in there? You gotta tell us. Do no drugs. Weapons. Ooh. You got more more rats? Probably. What's, it, guys, what's the most embarrassing thing in your search history in the last week? Uh, I look up a lot of crime. I just uh, but I uh, also looking into a uh, better uh, uh, recipe for uh, for butterscotch cookies. Now, the, most, this, uh, the worst thing in my search history is how to belittle the, a game warden. I feel, I feel, I really need to talk to you. What? Yeah, you would need help on that, wouldn't you? Yeah, that's yeah, basically saying you need help it. with it. You would. That's why you're. That's why he's embarrassed of it. 
When was the last yeah. time you tied a woman to the train tracks and then twirled your mustache before running away? Uh, comic like a year I shaved my I mustache. Like that. Oh, that's that's for you. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I would I would imagine it was about 15 days ago for you, Fred. No, no. No, I listen. I have to know that I go to corrupt cops anonymous. Yeah, I'm the Jaguar. He has my Jaguar. comic book. Oh, it's too sad. It makes me feel I'm bubbly. That's alcohol, sir. What? Have you been bloody? Oh, yeah. oh that's why I have a green golf dinner. <laughs> what in there? Anyways, what <laughs> All right, I'm going to get what this guy out of here. Him? What? What value does this guy him... offer? What does he do? This guy can't know, be something. He, he was he shot at by a cop. What did he just give me alcohol? What do you want from me? Fortunately, we already know. we already took a statement, so we're good on that. End. Oh, yeah. All right, I never got it. That's in a report. Didn't ask. Yeah, it's it's already prepared in a report. Uh, let's hmm. see. Which right. is it? it is report name? seven seven four four nine. Is it your best friend? Okay. Is it a male or a female uh, rat? Know. You don't know? It's your best friend. You don't even know? I don't assume. I thought you were best friends. Yeah. Best um, friends usually know that about each Fred, other. Fred, were you wanting to take this one over and, and look into it? No, no. You, if you guys already handled it, I'm just going to go fuck myself. Well, I mean, he... <laughs> no, you got two no, wives no, to do that for Lord. you, Fred? Uh, three wives. Oh. Where I also have a shaman sleep? marriage. Jenny. <laughs> you want to know something? Hey. You know what? I'm getting out of here. All, All right, right. I'm going to go grab I'm going to go grab my charger. I'm going to go off duty. I'm going to go up to Liquid Library and I'm going to get trashed. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to start a bar fight. And I hope you guys oh, hell respond yeah. to it. You know what? By the time we get there, you'll be the last one standing. The big old bottle of their strong. Well, I am, I am there. a champion. Mm -hmm. All right. I expect sir, nothing let's less. Go ahead and get you out of the lobby. Nobody cares. All right. Come on. All let's right. go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Pick up your hat. Hey, be come be on, careful, asshole. Fred. The la last time cops went to Mirror Park, one of them actually died. So. That's true. Actually, the last oh. time an alcoholic cop went to Mirror Park, they died. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. So, yeah. Uh, Tessa, you are, you're canine certified now, so if you want to throw the canine, if you didn't uh, have it on there already, you can throw the canine livery back in any vehicles you want. You can use uh, the canine vest if you choose to, and you're welcome Hooray. to patrol. Basically, uh, unrestricted at this point as canine, because you're, other than me, you're the only one who's authorized. So I'm going to try to get uh, at least two people certified for shift one, shift two, and shift three. Um, but the certifications okay. are kind of getting doled out pretty slow, so I don't know... All right. Uh, how long it's going to take. But I'm going to try to get one next and then three and then I'll go back to the shift and I'll probably get this guy over here on a board and then we're going to go back to one again. I'll try to get somebody else, then three, and then we'll have at least two for each shift. Then we'll start branching out from there. Okay. Very good. All right, Bundy. I will uh, I will uh, get out there and get hunting and I'll let you know if uh, anything comes up. Heck yeah. This Thanks is gold, though. I've got some uh, mountains to climb, so. Beautiful. Well, good luck. Happy hunting. All right. Hey, Ripley. You want to, uh... yep. What rank is Scout? Um, let's see. So you are the game warden, um, and Scout retains one rank higher than your position uh, at the highest. So here's how it, it's supposed to be one rank higher than the handler. But the way I, the little caveat I put on, because Los Santos is a little different than anywhere else, is one rank highest than the highest rank that the handler has ever obtained. Because just because the handler gets demoted again doesn't mean the dog ever should, obviously. That wouldn't be fair. So uh, when I was chief of police, I would commonly introduce Zero as, uh, I would say, hello, I'm chief of police Ripley, and this is Supreme Allied Commander Zero. Uh, so you, uh, as a game warden, have the freedom to choose a rank befitting uh, of scout. Wait, that means Ted's still the chief of police. Uh, that's, that's correct. That's exactly what that means. Yes. I don't really know how ranks work. Well, I just thought making really... him a general would be really funny. Yeah, well, that's yeah, military, that's but... you could do you could do general one hundred percent. 
You could do Emperor, you could do General, you could do... Commodore? Uh, Commodore, you could do Commodore <laughs> if you want. It's so cute. Yeah. Oh, that's true. You could just do my CI. Yeah. I'll have to think on it. Yeah, all right. Take some time and okay. think about it. And uh, whatever you think Scout would like best, you go right ahead and you start introducing Oh, I think you'll like a lot of things. Very good. Right. I gotta pick the right one. <laughs> try. Don't, feel free to try a couple on if you want. Be like, call him Czar. Call him, you know, whatever. And then like, see what he kind of like. What if his ears perk up and he's happier than you know it sticks, you know? Maybe I'll get him a knighthood. A knight, knighthood? Sir, Sir Scout. Scout. Yeah. <laughs> that could certainly work. That could certainly work. Great. We'll try a bunch of them on and we'll see what, what, what you're going right. to end up going with. All right. Okay. Thank you, Ripley. <laughs> no problem. Good luck. Well, let's go. Let's go get uh, General Scout uh, out with us. Oh, how you doing there? I went and got him fitted for his vest. Let me go uh, change to a canine uniform. Heck yeah. I'll get the Explorer ready. Um, I still have the canine. I think I might have removed it. Oh man. Yeah, I'm gonna have to look through different uh ranks and stuff to see what makes the most sense. But I like Commodore a lot. I think that's a cute one. Yeah, I normally do baggy pants with this. We could probably go with the cap today. Oh, okay. Easy. Tessa, how you doing? Good. Good, good. How are you? Hello. Hi, Tessa. Hi. Hey, I kind of respect. I thought you said, oh, Jesus. Bye. I might have got hit. Pretty hard by that world <laughs> yeah, you might. Have. Come on, scout. Right, me and the me and the game warden and Commodore Scout are gonna get out there to. Uh... Commodore Scout is that Tessa's dog? Yeah, she just got uh, she's got re canine certified. Oh, congratulations there, Tessa. Should I do Commodore or Brigadier General? I think the longer the better. I think Brigadier General is the best. Wait, are you talking about name wise, or do you have two dogs? No, no, rank wise. He has oh. rank. He's one rank above me, but I can kind of pick and choose what I want. I think you might want to be careful just... having the dog one rank above you. He Why? could end up firing you. No, no, that's, that's I, well, standard canine procedure. I mean, is it standard canine procedure? Okay. Scout would never fire me. He, he could mutiny. Him and I, well, he already does mutiny. Mooney Road. Scout's a diversity hire. I don't know if you knew this. Is he? Yeah. He bites everyone. Uh. If you get in his way, he'll just, he'll just chew on is, you. Okay. Yep. Well, I like dogs. Um, I'm gonna step back. Whoa, 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 whoa. He thirsts for blood. The blood yeah. of his enemies. How about officers? Is he cool with officers? No, he's bitten officers before. 
Were they UPD or were they in a uniform? What, let's get some descriptions here. I mean, pretty much all sorts, I think. He just, you know, it's, it's mostly like, you know, oh, if he bites you and you bleed, then that's kind of what he's looking for. Yep, I'm out of here. Hey, uh, Vampire dog. Bundy. That's his rank, Vampire. Yeah. You're gonna put laxatives That's a copper popper guy. Uh, apparently, Pred put him in jail. Come on, guys. Get to work. What? Standing around. Get to work. Do something. Honathan! Oh my god, is that, uh, is that Honathan? Honathan! Hey, what did, what did he have on him? What are y'all doing? Uh, me and Bunny are gonna go out with, um, Brigadier General Scout here. I thought the last time that Scout went out, he almost fired you. He almost fired me? Yeah. What? He outranks you. Well, yeah, he's a Brigadier General. And or exactly. a Commodore. And maybe a Knight as well. Okay, okay. Well, you all have fun. I'm going to do paperwork. Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, I got to write a report. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I, I am too. I tried to pass it off. It didn't work. Well, Godspeed. I have a judge calling me. Good luck. Yeah. Hello, Tessa Lamb, K9 officer. <laughs> Tessa Lamb, it's Bill Mays. How are you? I'm all right. How are you? Not too bad. Hey, um, do I have permission to give your phone number to someone who needs to talk to you? Uh, who is it? Joey Keys. Uh, sure, that's fine. You remember him? Wait. PBSO? BCSO, what? Joey Keys. I see. Wait a minute. Yeah, he's here. It's been like a bazillion years, though. Yeah, he's on the front steps of uh, Mission Row. He's back. Okay. But. Well, yeah, that's that's fine. Okay. Yeah, he tried to talk to Bass, and Bass was busy. But, yeah, he's just trying to reconnect with everybody. Okay. I forgot it was BCSO when you were around. Fuck, it has been a long time. Yeah. Let's yeah. BCSO again. There you go. It is BCSO <laughs> again. That's right. Okay. I'm a okay. All right. Award, All right. Man. I just wanted to make sure I had permission before I sent it to you. Sent no it to problem. Him. Thank you for checking. Thank you. Have a good day. Yeah, you too. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Wow, somebody who uh, was around a very long time ago is back in the city. Oh, who's that? Uh, Joey Keys. Oh, I remember Keys. Do you? I yeah, wasn't sure if you were around when he was. Days. As I recall, I could be mixing him up with somebody else, but I think that he patrolled with Forcer occasionally. Mm -hmm. Um... <laughs> And I, re I remember him from the dispatch days. I, I don't think he's been on duty since I was hired, though. Well, so that guy uh, texted me and he said his, his text is all jumbled, but I can barely read it. It says they put me in jail for drinking that stuff Kyle Pred gave me. Help. And then there's a picture of him. Is the picture of him in jail? Uh, or? I can't really tell. Actually, it looks like it might be Mission Row. Oh, maybe they put him in the drunk tank until he sobers up a little bit. I mean, I still think that might be entrapment, but that's that's less of an us problem and more of a he needs a lawyer problem. By the way, Avery is up here checking fishing licenses already. Oh, nice. Yeah, Hear she, that called scout? she uh, caught, a, caught a bozo up there who didn't have a fishing license and who said that uh, it was okay because they were doing catch and release and she wanted to check with me to make sure that that was not the case. Tessa, I have a question. I have a question. 
What is your question? Can I convert Ted's rank to park ranger ranking system once he is research once I'm recertified? Uh yes. Okay. I just didn't want to go around introducing him as game warden Ted when and when when you're the, the <laughs> one true holder of that title. What's um Winchester's stream name? Also, you know how I've been doing my best to not bother you for the last two weeks? Now that you're canine certified, I'm gonna bother you all the goddamn time. There are so many calls that I go on where I'm like, oh, if only we had a canine here. <laughs> Hello, Dahlia. I can't tell where this is. Oh, is this? That's, okay, Hold that's on. not good. Why are, they, why are they trying to kill you? It's beaver bush? I, I really can't tell. Yes. Okay, he's it. Okay. Oh, Are this they is sending Tessa, these... phone guy. Hey, Tessa, it's Joey Keys. How you doing? Good. Mm, How are you? Or the uh, the I'm doing box well. It's okay. been a while. Um, it has been. Yeah, I took a plane trip out to Jamaica a couple years ago. Got the opportunity. Right. Um, so. Snap a photograph. Uh, but now I'm back. Note for me is Jeffy still alive? Welcome Bolingbrook? back. Thank you. Um, See, so yeah, I, I, I think Bill already told you when he, he was on the phone yeah, yeah, looking to uh, try and get rehired here. I was trying um, to get in touch with uh, Toretti. Okay, that's who, I just uh, want to make sure that he didn't Ripley said if I wanted to get back in the BCSO. Yeah. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep trying okay. to get in contact uh, with him. I figured he might be another lead I might be able to uh, uh, um, might be able to help me. I'm not too sure. I did talk to Bass a little bit ago, um, and he said... Uh, from his standpoint, that y'all aren't hiring gotten, right now. Yeah, further uh, yeah. The whole UPD shakeup stuff. Uh, try again a month and a half once that's all over. But if uh, one of the department heads wanted to pick me up, uh, that would be on on them basically. Jesus okay. Christ. Okay. Um. Yeah. So I don't really know what yeah, we're doing yeah, with you, the hiring process You guys process and Kiki right really now. attract the crazies, I think, don't you? Um, we might need to wait, but mm -hmm. I don't want to make any promises. Well, uh, got human you definitely will weeks, want to get in touch so. with Reddy because he'll be the one that will probably pick you up. Or you can contact okay. Libby Reed. She's the LSPD. But if you want to get back into BCSO, that's uh, going to be your place. Is uh, to Reddy. All right. All right. So but, it sounds like I need to be around when he's in town. Yeah, he's um a little bit earlier than right now. Probably several hours, actually. Yeah. So it might be a little Train difficult. Train complications and uh, other obligations tend to make that difficult, but I'll try and make it yeah. work. Yeah. Okay, well, if all else fails, I will try to put in a good word for you. Um, do what you can on your own, and then uh, yeah. if you are having uh, so much trouble that you just can't hey, well, get through to anyone, uh, just let me know, and I'll try to help you out, okay? I can't yeah, really no, any promises, because obviously we are in sort of a hiring freeze. There's a couple people in your spot right now. Oh boy, okay. Uh, so, oh yeah, no, I, I totally understand. All right, yeah, no but in the meantime, it's good to have you back in the city. Well, thank you. I appreciate maybe, that. Maybe maybe spend some time getting yourself reestablished, get to know some people, some of the new officers. Yeah. Are you yeah, are y'all doing any uh any ride along type things or? Uh, I probably can't right now, and I'm, I'm honestly not the best person to ride along with right now. I'm oh, yeah, no, constantly I, on the phone, but... I, I just kind of meant in general, like, the police force in general, not not like you right now specifically. <laughs> yeah, I'm proud of you. Okay, uh, well, 
If you have anyone in specific you want to ride along with, just let me know and I can potentially approve it. Okay. If they uh, want to pick in you mind up. Right now. Yeah, nobody in mind right now. Just kind of like a general uh, question kind of thing. Yeah, uh, high command approval right now is ride alongs. Okay. All right, cool. But for you, I'm willing to entertain that as long as someone wants to pick you up. So if you find anyone uh, you remember who remembers you that wants to take you out, feel free to ask. All right. I appreciate that, Tessa. No problem. Happy to help. All right. Well, I'll catch you around. I won't keep you busy because I'm uh, right. probably busy doing other stuff. Well, you know, just being a game warden. Always on the phone. Yeah. Yeah. Bill told me about the promotion. Congratulations. Thank you. Well deserved. All right. Well, deserved. well, it's good to hear from you. I'll let you go. But thanks for the call. Yeah, no problem. Thank you for uh, taking the call. I'll uh, catch right. you around, Tessa. Bye. 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 Well, I feel bad. What do you feel bad about? Mm -hmm. Well, he wants his job back and everything, and now it's just like the worst possible time. Yeah, this isn't a great time to. You also, try thank to get you for the two months, Teresa. Welcome back. Thing, yeah. Jeremy, thank out. you for the four months. Welcome back as well. Uh, Yellow Shrews, thank you for the prime. Because unfortunately, instead of competing with uh, a small handful of people, they're competing with uh, the entire Unified Police Department. Yep. So I, I basically told him he can he can go to Toretti, but I don't think they're wanting us to hire anyone yet. At least not until everyone else gets sorted out, you know? Yeah, no, 100%. Well, didn't see anybody above the lost area. Didn't see anybody over by uh, by the watch. Check the poacher's path up here and see if there's anybody hanging around up there. Is there anywhere in particular out here that you've got better luck? just around this area is pretty common yeah this is this, this is, is where we found the path. other guy yeah this is uh, this is where me and uh flop got uh, palermo as well yeah this is where he got caught the second time mm -hmm. look at him look look at him tessa it's four rabbits oh and it's, it's too many it's too many rabbits Oh, there's there's two more. You just wait. The further up the hill there, you go, the there's more no more. such thing as too many rabbits. Yes, there is. When the when was the last time you saw a carrot? I see them on, on my way into work all the time. Mm, I don't know. I've been riding riding around out here in these hills, and I've I've, I've seen a grand total of one carrot. Oh, you know what they do when on. they run out of the... Oh, it's a cop. Never mind. Yeah, yeah. I think that's... Um... Shoot, what the heck is his name? Oh, that's uh, that's actually Tommy that's up here. Yeah, Tommy and uh, Moses are both... Uh... Up and rolling the path that I've shown them. Looks like he's rolling down towards the lumber mill, though, instead of up towards the top. Look, there's two up here, and then look, they're having a meeting down here. There's four to the left and four to the right. You can't tell me that's normal, Tessa. Well, I mean, I'm sure it's fine. You know, uh, they've, they've got to do their, their foraging. 
It ain't fine. Look, there's barely any grass up here. They're going to start eating the darn trees. Have you ever trees. seen Watership Down? No. Okay, I'm going to give you some homework. We're going to need to watch Watership Down. Is this uh, about them rabbits that ate that boat? What? I did see that on the Wikipedia. They ate a boat? Yeah, yeah, they were being transported and they ate straight through the hole of the boat because they didn't have enough oh, food. Oh, God. That's horrible. But no, Watership Down is like, um, it's an old cartoon based on a book. And, um, once you watch it, you'll understand how the problem will take care of itself eventually. They have a whole political system. I don't know, I think they, I think they unionized. Well, not too many folks up here tonight. I think we've actually got pretty good coverage up in the hills, though, with uh, both stone and malarkey rolling around. Oh, my turn for the phone to ring. What's going on, Carter? Very wholesome movie. <laughs> yes, uh, she said that... Uh, Man, we actually, you know what? That's a thing. She was going Chat, to we're going to need to do a game night. Send it over to me. Or not uh, a game I night, a movie night for Watership it, Down. Uh, the old original. She said that Winston had a report earlier, so I was just going to update that one. I... <laughs> Yeah, we can go meet with her together. Find out where she's at, and uh, I'm rolling. I'm rolling with Tessa at the moment. <sighs> yeah. Uh, we are in the hills, but we can come down to. Uh, why don't you call Dahlia? Find out. Okay, perfect. Yeah, we'll meet you. At... All right, heck yeah. Let's uh, let's meet at Beaver Bush, and then we'll go from there. Right. Oh, that was uh, that's cute. And Carter wants uh, he wants to roll with us because he wants to learn how better how to do investigative crimes. Oh, are we going to Mission Row? Oh my God! What the heck? What just happened? Something exploded. What the heck exploded? Is it the military? I don't think it's the military. Did the military leave? Okay, I think we have that guy still stuck in jail. I, I don't know. I think Kyle left him in the drunk tank. I, is, he, is he still texting? I think he's alone down there. That, um, that does unfortunately sound like a very cred move. Oh, why can't I turn my lights off? Uh-oh. Oh, no, that's, not, that's not good. <laughs> Hold on, I'm going to pull uh -oh. over. <laughs> Are we having a headache? I can't get in my pockets or turn the lights on on the vehicle, so I'm just going to wait. I think bad wait. things are happening. I think they might be. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Oh, no, Bundy. <laughs> One. Sure. 
Hey, someone. Right on duty. <clears throat> Tessa, what the, hello, what do you want, game warden? What are you doing right now? I'm with the colonel right now. What do you want, game warden? I want to know do why. Ocean dump geeky. I don't care about that right now. I'm I'm talking about the guy that I last saw you with. He's in the cell. He's in the cell waiting for the colonel. Well, why has he been in there for the last half hour? That's where he wants to be. He has my number when he wants to leave. Game well, warden. Why is he texting me then? You are mad with power. What? You are mad with power. I Game haven't done warden anything. Lamb, and I'm watching you. What? I don't understand, Pred. I'm not getting on to you. I just want to know what I the heck is going on with him. Should, well, maybe you should go talk to him. I'm not sure. He's he's twatting out. Let me out of jail, Pred. What's he twatting out? It, it says, let me out of jail. I don't think he's in jail. He's in the cell. He's, he's in a cell, yes. That is a jail cell. That's not jail. Look, the colonel uh, told yes. me to put him there until he talked to him. I don't know what you want me to do. You should be calling the colonel. Okay. I'm just following orders, ma'am. Do not strike me. I'm already at like 55 points. Yeah, that's unsurprising. Goodbye. Okay. Bye! <laughs> God. I swear to God. No! <laughs> Buddy, please! Hello. Hello, oh, welcome got, back. This car got really banged up when I had a headache. Yeah, we got rear-ended. Oh, yeah. That'll I just kind of sat in the passenger seat and waited. <laughs> uh, let me call Carter back. Let me know. Do you want to go to MRPD to tackle um, yeah, that one guy who's all stuck in the holding cells and whatnot? Yeah, I think we should, because I, I don't really know what's going on. Pred, I called Pred, and he said that he left him in there because my dad told him to. Oh. Hey, uh, Carter, uh, 25 with me at MRPD instead, because Tessa has to tackle uh, another issue. Hello, uh, Freddy. How I'll, can I help I'll you? I'll call Dolly. Hey, in the hey how you doing, Tessa? Um, oh, you know. Can meet up. Okay, you ain't busy. You still got a warrant? No, I don't anymore. Actually, I don't. Unfortunately, I didn't. I got caught by sweets before Charlotte could even chase me. It sucks. Unfortunately. Okay. Um, I'm sorry about the other day. I apologize. I felt like a dick. That, I didn't want to fly okay. away from you. Uh, hey, so uh, are you with Jeffy? Okay. I can We're, tell uh, you meet I'm gonna have to take a rain check on this one, but I will call you back, okay? Okay. Right. There's, there's somebody that's been locked in a cell that I need to go deal with. Okay, well, whenever you're not busy, uh, uh, I'm trying to set up something for Charlotte, and uh, I wanted you to be involved in it, so I thought maybe you'd like it. Okay. Um, um, pick, 
pick a location I'm very busy. and text it to me. And I don't know yeah. exactly when I'll be available. That's fair. No, I understand. And I don't want to be the factor that causes you to wait up. Okay. Um, well, I just need to give Is you it something. important? It would only take a few minutes. Yeah, right. a little bit. Them, I have but... them okay. Right. I'll see if I can make time. Okay. No uh, worries. I'm not really busy. All right. Let me figure this out, and then I'll, I'll call oh, you back, okay? Right. Alrighty, no worries. All right. Bye. Uh, driving. Just try to okay, we're pulling over a dodo truck. Goodness, glaciers. Yeah, you know, we can go here. We can get the car repaired. We'll swap into the charger. Spring uh, copper popper loose from holding. Give me a bug to run for lots of that truck. So, so Bass said to just leave the guy down there? Apparently, I don't know. The guy said he wanted to talk to Bass, and so Bass said to just leave him down there. And now Fred and Bass are talking or something, and Bass won't answer his phone. Who the heck is this person that Bass is riding with? Scully down? Is that a pirate? That sounds this like a pirate. 60, 76, <laughs> It will have all its tires shut out. We shot, we shot a bunch of them. Uh, yeah, I found the next two days. Uh, after that, we need to meet with Dahlia and Jeffy, who are being stalked by an individual who is apparently targeting both of them, which I can only assume is related to their profession. Or something okay. that they personally did, maybe. But they received a note at the hospital saying they were being uh, followed, so... Yesterday, Flop and I went to, I think, one of their houses. And, uh, their car had been shot up. Jesus. That's... Yeah, okay. so there was there was another thing going on with that. Uh, this guy does have green shoes on, so go check for him, drive. Crime gaming. You know that with Prime Gaming, you can bump up the subathon timer? It's true. All right. I definitely didn't fail at putting that in the bushes. Scout hates these stairs. Come on, Scout. Yeah, I'm gonna pick you up. He's such a baby sometimes. Hey, guys. Hello. I've seen anything for him drive. I see another... Here, I think Actually, that was pretty good in that uniform. He looks like Whitney. Tried to pull over initially. Right, fuck you, oh really? That's not very nice, Kyle. If I could, get out of here. If get I could do a department, I'd be a ranger. Get out of here! Get out of here, dispatch. Oh, I just, I what is happening in here? What do you want, game warden? What, what do you want? Why is there screaming coming out of this room, huh? There's not. There's, There's no screaming. I'm trying to get out. Through. Hey, it's Bundy. Ranger. Bundy. How do you like being a ranger? If you had to rate it on a scale of 1 to 10, okay, him being the most shit funny you ever had, he one looks being awful. Absolutely Look boring. at him. I have no signs of them, right? What, uh, as compared to what? Being in the UPD or part of one of the general? Oh, the past. Just the, be just the past. Oh, yeah, but were they, things uh, better well, before? No. No, I don't agree with that. I get to patrol. I get to do investigations. I still get to help people, but not like because it's mandatory. It's only because I want to do it. You could do all that, though. No, I couldn't, because I, I actually took the responsibility of being high command very seriously, so I was always like stuck what? in meetings. What meetings? What is happening? Why? Oh. You'd be surprised. Remember, there was like a three-month period where all you did was yeah, hang out in a log a cabin. What fucking meeting? What do you mean all I did was hang out on a log? When did I ever hang all out on a log hang, cabin? hang out off Route 68. I never hung out off of Route 68. I the hung out near the lighthouse for a me while. Me and Wrangler know all about... What, what meetings? 
Okay. Hey, you didn't do much, Dad, are you aware that honest. there's a man in the cells downstairs? Yeah, I told, I, I told Kyle to place him in the drunk tank because he was completely intoxicated and couldn't even walk, right? He was drunk as a skunk at one point. Okay. Do, has anyone gone to check on him? I don't believe so. I was going to, but um, I was talking to Kyle about some state stuff. Yeah, he okay. wants me to join the I'm going to go check on him. Test. That's what's up. That's, I never said that. No, I that's said the not first part, how that not works. the second part. Yeah, that's how that Excuse works. Me. So it works. When I become Everyone knows your boss, you're going to be fucking miserable. That's interesting. So I haven't really I was, thought I about you at all, Fred. Colonel, did you tell him what you told me about the charges? <laughs> oh, rent free, bro. <laughs> okay, whatever. Twenty-five months, Hey, Tessa. Hi. Hello. All right, hey, Tessa. man. Well, you've been here for the whole time, so you're just gonna get for all. I would like to go. Hello, right. has anyone in here checked on this man? But you want to be sent up, correct? I want to leave, yeah. Oh, cool. I finally have a clear shot of that rat. Don't do that. Is he okay? Him? He was just talking. He was making fun of uh, not Carmella. Who I swear is probably Carmella. I ain't no damn Carmella. What's your name again, ma'am? Because someone Did literally just. Oh, oh yeah, the That 70s oh, Show. Boom, but okay. it's, it's not Car Carmella. Why do you keep calling her that then? It's not Carmella. Okay, so Jackie. Uh... Oh, that's eagle. Yeah. I like your sunglasses. Thank you. They're with me. Uh, sir. All right. Are you okay? Oh. Uh, sorry, I had a little napsy. Have you sobered up? Right, yeah, I'm a little sober now. I'm Carmella, feeling better. If you follow me outside and get your possession, two people. Fine. What's going on? All right. Well, you mind coming with me? Yes, of course. Do you need to place, place me in handcuffs? Or you unlock the cell? Oh, you unlock it. All right, all right. Yeah. I mean, I will place you in cuffs if I need to, but. No, I'm not going to cause any problems. How do you feel now? Tessa, is, is he sober? Is he clear he, to walk he out He seems here? pretty sober now. I'm, I'm all right. Okay. All right. So we want to talk to you about what happened at Mr. OPD. I just, yep. um, the person that you said that was involved, I tried to uh, call and investigate further, but they're not around. They went to bed. So there's not much to do. <laughs> oh, that's fine. Well, that, that'll be handled, right? I'm not, all, I'm, all, I'm not all too worried about that. I believe in you, in you fine folk. Yes. Tessa, did you make a report about that? Uh, yes, there is already a report uh, ready to go. We just need to interview the proper individuals. Okay, so... Um, God, uh, I would like Walker. my handcuffs from Bass over there. Come this way. Yeah. Uh, we are, uh, yeah, these guys. It's a one-time attempt at murder of a government employee. Move over, Fingal. One-time attempt at murder of a government employee. I'm going to put out the wire right now. Excuse us. Thank you, Fingal. No problem. Okay, so um, you said that when you got to the lobby, Mr. FPD, yes. somebody saw a rat on your shoulder and started freaking out, started shooting towards your direction. Yes, they shouted, "Rat, rat!" and it started opening fire on my shoulder. And the person was talking. What kind of dialect, as far as the accent they had? Was it British? Was it American? Was it Southern? What was it? Very deep, I guess. Deep. Okay. Did you tell um if it was? You know, an American accent, was it English, what was it? Can you, can you tell if there's any, um, let me stood out to you. Three, three, one, I'm not one to presume three, accent, I honestly can, couldn't tell you. I'd be probably British. <laughs> okay. It could have, could have been any dialect, I'm not sure. All right, and the officers, uh, sorry, the person that shot you, can you describe their, like, uh, facial or from, or any description, anything that stand out, tattoo, markings, uh, scars? Mm. I guess... They had a well-defined jaw line, I guess. Uh, I, they were wearing sunglasses at the time. I can't really describe facial features all that well, do you? I mean, uh, they were male. They had uh, Adidas-style pants with the two striped lines down the side. You know the ones we're talking about? Like a like a jacket. Looks like a... It was either leather or polyester. Couldn't, I don't really know. Uh, I couldn't really describe all too much about it. There was a uh, dispatcher that saw it all. Apparently. Yeah. Oh, which dispatcher? 
We've, we've already taken a full statement from the dispatcher, uh, Colonel. Okay, all right, so we're good. Is there any other questions that we need? All right. Uh, so an, is that, yeah, aside uh, from questioning the individual that is being accused, uh, we don't really have any further questions. All right, okay, so um, let's walk you out. Uh, listen, if you remember anything as far as this incident, right. please dial 31191 to put in an emergency what's going on, and um, we'll be in touch. I can assure you that we're taking this very seriously, and whoever attacked you, the law of Mishra PD will face justice. I can assure Phenomenal. you that. Phenomenal! You know that's not the original me reason I wanted to meet with you there, right? Yeah, I, w I was going to say, I, I don't think that was why he was even I've here to talk to you. I've been trying for about four hours now to speak with you about this business proposal. Oh, the magician. Oh my I'm goodness, so sorry. I'm really sorry. <laughs> it's all right. All right. So you said you wanted a magician, right? Here's a magician. Yeah, yeah. Hello. Hello. Yeah. I don't really do fancy. I do like card tricks, but I don't have any cards on me. I have a, do I have my tarot deck? I do have my tarot deck. Oh, okay. Tarot. I always thought it was pronounced I'm a, tarot. I'm a, you either. I I get confused. Why would the second T be be silent, but the first one's not? It's like pick a lane, right? <laughs> if they're either both silent or they're, they're both not. Yeah, let me pull a card for you. Okay. Oh, here we are. Wow, look mm -hmm. at him go. Mm -hmm. huh. All right, we got the Knight of Cups. Oh, upside down. Yes. Oh. Okay. Just like her car is right now, which is why she's in custody. Ah, uh, normally she means sideways, not upside down. The upside, upside down normally means you're finding excuses uh, uh, to blame yourself for your own, uh, for your you're problems welcome, Colonel, or someone else's problems. Dad, we'll take care of the rest of this. Uh, you don't worry to about your sure. part of it. Inside inside I will keep you posted on it, but I will take the lead on it. Is that, yeah, is that, you know, is that, I want to know why an officer just ra saw randomly shooting a Michelle. That's Kiki. what I would like to know as well, especially uh, when it's an officer that's trying to become a ranger. Thank you. So. Oh, Jesus. Okay, all right. Yeah. Okay, thank you. All right, then, if you got it, thank you. Where? Where did they go? Oh man! Oh, let me sit in the back. It's all good. Oh no, you're good. A, I got Scout, scout back here. Us? He might be a little grouchy. All right. Yeah, scout, Scout's a little bloodthirsty. Don't make direct eye contact with Scout okay. for longer nah, than three fine. seconds. All right, it's cool. All right. I don't plan on looking at Scout like that. Who? Uh, so basically, oh. Winston, yeah, uh, uh, Winston Walker, he wants to be a ranger, but thing. apparently Rangers there was a situation in the Mission Row PD brother, lobby uh, earlier today for bumping his car uh, where he shot someone's rat while brother. it was sitting on their shoulder and yes. he ended up shooting uh, them too. Uh, so yeah, so don't know the full situation from him was, yet, uh, but we're gonna have to talk to him. Not uh, a good I don't look know exactly though. What happened, I'll say that much. Interesting. I was there at the Harvey, scaling, thank you it? for the prime 42 months. Uh, Welcome back. But yeah, Appreciate she was you. saying some wild shit was going on with her. I don't know how much you know about it. Uh, uh, she briefly filled me in about a note that they received at the hospital indicating they were both in danger, which is why I coded through those last two lights, but not this one because I don't want to draw attention there in the maze bank uh, parking lot over there. Um, Got you. And then she said that there was also a note placed at her personal residence uh, earlier tonight that had photos of Jeffy, I guess. Uh, yeah, while he was some in creepy prison. photo shit. Yeah, yeah. 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 And then Tessa was saying that yesterday yeah. there was another incident. There was something last night with me and Flop looking into it in uh, Bison. Let me get the gotcha. incident. Because I got a call about it today. Uh, apparently, there was also a photo on that one, too, that got added. Yeah. Weird. Okay. What up? What up? Uh, how we doing? Uh, hanging in here. Who are the other two folks who are with us? Um, the uh, A-Squad. A-Squad. Okay. Oh, All right. Scout. If, if you're comfortable with them, then... Scout. Uh, oh. We can probably we can probably step away to have a conversation. 
I think they're gonna listen to the radio. Yeah, yeah. Oh, are they doing uh, siren radio tonight? Yeah, yeah. Scout, you can't run off like that. I'm gonna have Scout in the car. I don't have keys. Or they're not working alone and uh, send it to someone else to do it. But that's all I know. Um, from today. From from today, yeah. And the oh Tesla, god, ew. The tire incident you responded to last night, I think, is one hundred percent related. Because uh, while I do not have the first picture I gave it to Winston uh, earlier today, um, there was a picture taken of Dahlia uh, in the driveway of that house. And uh, where the picture is taken looks to be exactly where the casings were at. Creepy. Yep. You guys have any potential leads on who might be following you? No idea, unless you guys have got anything from the casings. Not as far as I'm aware, but... Um, it's all documented. Okay. Mm -hmm. Dahlia, let's, uh, let's hear your side of this while Jeffy was in prison. Yeah, so, um, um, after Jeffy was in prison, I met up with the A-Team. I got a notification that, uh... A-Squad, A-Team is copywritten. Sorry, A-Squad, <laughs> uh, that, um, mail had been delivered, um, an hour ago, uh, at the house at uh, picture perfect drive six which is the house that jeffy and i live at um and i got there and there were two notes there i think that i don't i think that um i didn't check the mail this morning did you check the mail this morning jeffy uh no no i did not so it's possible that the other note was there prior uh but I took pictures of the notes, uh, there. The first one was to the doctors. This is your formal warning. I'm going to kill you, uh, yours. Uh, sorry. Let me, uh, let me silence my phone real quick. And... Even not being command anymore doesn't save me from being a phone guy. Um, okay. The second uh, uh, was too easy to find, will be easy to kill. And those had the two photos, uh, which I also put on there, of uh, Jeffy at the prison. Okay, what what was the if you could do the math Spooky for me chat. since you received I got a stalker. What was the approximate delivery time of the uh the second note? Imagine having a stalker right now, chat. It was oh, one AM UTC. 
Ah, Cody Sharp would have been proud of the UTC. Okay. All right. Um, <laughs> we had a stalker once. Do either of your <laughs> knowledge have any notes like this been delivered to other? Do you rather have a stalker or a Pred? Medical group or stalker, hundred <laughs> percent. Uh, not as as far as I know, it's only been us. In the one that was left at the hospital, which Wrangler has. And refuses to give back to me. Although I feel sense. like Pred almost qualifies in my for the amount of times he just comes after I us. Didn't have <laughs> the chance to look at it proper. Uh, Tessa, do you think that you could work on trying to procure that note from Wrangler for us in the event that it's not in the arrest file? Uh, well, I mean, let me just even check it. Yeah, I, I checked the. Was this was this taken by Wrangler when you were arrested earlier, Jeffy? No, uh, it wasn't taken when he was arrested. At Dahlia. No, it, yeah, it, I mean it was. Yeah, well, it was, yeah, but Dahlia like showed it to him because we were like, "Hey, uh, she's being stalked. It's been a bad day." He goes, "Oh, oh yeah. I got you." And okay. then he like, she's like, "Yeah, look," and showed him the note, and he just kind of kept it to be a dick. I'll give him a call. I have more information. Um, Hello. Hey, Wrangler. Um, Hi, Tessa. So when you had uh, Jeffy earlier in the cells, uh, did he yep. give you a, a note of some kind? Yeah, I'm holding on to that. Uh, can I ask why? Yeah, it's uh, about a person who's trying to stalk and kill a woman. Yes, they're they're currently talking to me right now about it. it it's yep. So why are you holding on to it? Uh, well, I thought I'd take it upon myself to investigate the uh, oh. the stalking. Okay. Um. Well, they're, they're handing us all the stuff that they've got, so oh, I was hoping okay, that I could great. get that from you. Okay. Uh, I mean, is this an order? Because I kind of wanted to investigate this, but... You do? Uh-huh. Yeah. But if you're ordering me to do it, then, you know, I, well, obviously I got to listen to that. Well, I mean, uh, what have you got so far? We can work together so on it. I got, I got, I got to leave. Okay, is your lead Jeffy right now? That's he's one of them. But I also have Dan Dan as a lead. Dan Dan? Yeah, he's stalking bad. What? What makes you think it's Dan Dan? Well, he's a stalker, number one. Uh number two, he hates hos he hates the hospital staff. Oh. Yep. Okay. Well, uh, myself and Flop actually were investigating this last night, uh, along with Bison. We had uh, a scene, like, I can give you the report number, but I'd like if we could just all work together on it. Yeah, uh, I mean, I can just give you the note, that's fine, it's not a big deal. Alright, I think, I mean, just kind of consolidating it would probably be easiest. Uh, you're welcome to look into it, if you want. Um, okay, I gotta find Finkel, he has the note. I just, I just, I just give it Finkel to him. have the note? We well, because we do think it's Dan Dan, Dan Dan's his son. Oh. So, still in the glove box. Isn't that a conflict of interest? Uh, well, we're not lawyers or judges. I mean, well, okay, fair enough. Um, yeah, if you could get that for me, I'd appreciate it. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm at MRPD. I got it. Where are you at? Uh, I will come and get it. Okay. All right. I'm downstairs. Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Hey, I'm going to go get the note. Okay. Thank you, Tessa. Thank you, Tessa. Can I have keys? Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
You get that? Yes. Yeah. We're back. <laughs> Dan, Dan. What the heck? Working with Pratt and Wrangler seems like a nightmare. I mean, typically it's not. I mean, I don't really have an issue with it. Um, if he wants to work the case, he's welcome to. I just need to get the notes so we can document it. I don't even really need it. I just want to make sure it's in the report that we're doing, because we're already discussing. Jesus Christ! Wrangler! Oh my god, disgusting! We use that mop! Hello, Crane. Hey, um, I got a question for you. Uh, I got Aziz Abdallah here on a bench trial. Um, he He's kind of an idiot who usually doesn't contest most things. Um, but I'm actually kind of concerned about this one. There's a warrant that's written by Peachy. And it's... Uh, the other statement um, is taken and entered by Philomena Hawthorne. And it all just centers around Jack Ripley getting shot at a traffic stop. Uh, incident number is seven seven one seven zero. All right, hold on. Seven seven one seven zero. Yep. Just give that a skim real quick. Mizo, thank you for the 41 months. And uh, Controlled Burn, by the way, thank you for the five gifted as well. Appreciate you very, very much. Before I forget to say thank you. Good to see you, by the way. Uh... So the, the entirety of the evidence is that Dundee called someone Aziz. And according to Bones, Ripley, even though he's around, didn't want to come to bench trial and, and represent the warrant because he said that we don't take warrants to bench trial, which is not accurate. We do. We just need the officers involved there, which Ripley's the only officer involved. Right. Um, so I'm not I'm not really sure how this warrant even got like I, I don't I don't really understand because you know there's there's more than one disease in the world and yeah and in order to solidify whatever was seen or said or anything you need Ripley yeah uh. Yeah, I I don't know where he got that misconception that he can't represent a, a warrant. Oh, um, do you yeah. want me to get Ripley to come down there? Uh, may I mean, uh, maybe, what, but what I would mean, you I'm like also just. This? Well, I just I want your you know sort of. Is that enough for you guys to write warrants if someone says someone's name? For me, no. No, it's not. Because I don't, I don't, like, I'm trying to imagine the facts in the light most favorable to Ripley, right? Yeah. Let's say Ripley comes down here and he says that he was at a traffic stop and Dundee 
was unmasked. There Sorry, were five Mabel. or six masked individuals. And Dundee said something like to the effect of like, you send my friend to prison. And then, you know, uh, I got to get moving. Calls right. the guy Thank Aziz. You. And then the Aziz guy shoots Ripley. And Ripley says that he sent an Aziz Abdallah to prison. I don't know if that's enough to convict Aziz Abdallah of shooting Ripley. I no, I personally don't think so either. I think uh, this warrant was not detailed enough. Um, I don't think there's enough evidence pointing towards Aziz being the person. Uh, personally, his DNA was not seen. The casing, I I don't know if they have a gun that comes back to that casing. I don't think they do. Um, I mean, so and then what happened today? kind of actually interesting is kind of the same thing which in this case might be okay um but it's kind of funny the way it happened bones was at strawberry gas somebody was in a car with aziz abdallah who was wearing a mask uh and the guy called him aziz and bone heard aziz's voice so he did a felony stop which to me is okay because that's just reasonable suspicion right to like detain someone and see if they are the person you're looking for yeah um but, you know, even if that part's okay, I still don't know how I can charge Aziz with this attempt to murder a government employee. And, I'm, and I mean, like, I'm looking at it in light most favorable Nine, to Ripley, seven, 10, And I still don't know if there's a way I sustain a conviction for attempt to murder a government employee. Uh, as well as, you know, the confusion about Ripley coming down here or not. So I don't know if you want me to talk to Ripley, if you want to talk to him, but... I need to know how, you know, how to proceed because it seems like Ripley has a misinterpretation of how we deal with warrants. Yeah, I personally, I agree with you. Um, I'm happy to talk to him or if you would like to yourself to articulate exactly uh, what you would have been looking for and maybe clear up that misconception for him. Uh, it works either way for me. Uh, I just okay. don't know how busy you are. No, I mean, I'm just doing, doing, settling this issue. Come on, so Nancy. I'll, uh, I'll call Ripley. Oh my God, why are you so scary, Nancy? I'm waiting for you. Can I was, I was not paying attention. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll call Ripley. Okay, uh, thank, thank you, Crane. I appreciate it. I'm sorry that that happened to you. You're uh, fine. Let me know if I need to do anything on my end. You should um, be okay. Because I can, I can issue strike points or whatever if need be for I this. I don't think it's a strike issue. I just, I. I want to make sure that officers don't think that they don't have to respond to bench trials for warrants. If they're available and yeah. the warrant is their information and, he is, he and there's nothing available. else in there, then, you know, they should be doing it. Yeah, I agree. Um, All right. I'll, I'll make sure that's drilled into people's heads. I'll sort it out. Thank you. Thank you. Well, Hello. Okay, How can I help you? How can you help yourself? You lost me. You lost me, Tessa. Oh, oh hey, you're you LSPD. You lost me to the LSPD. That's right. I, well, I think that this is great for you. I'm, I'm very happy that you got to be in uh, a great department. Mm-hmm. You lost me, Tessa. I'm... Uh, I, uh... Look, there's a... I gotta get to an investigation that was ongoing. Um, I'll, uh, you know, great job. Congratulations on your promotion. Goodbye, I, Tessa. Goodbye, Nancy. You will goodbye. regret today for okay. the rest of your All life. Right. Goodbye, Nancy. Oh, God, she's so scary, dude. What? I looked down from my thing and she was just there. Sorry, sorry. That's all right. Okay, and we were... Where is that little thing? That's right here, I think.
Yeah, I got I need oh, copies of them there. Yeah, no. I'm just saying I need copies if you need them. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah I, I already grabbed you those as know. well. So. Mm -hmm. Tessa does trust the floor in here. Oh, sorry. Yeah, Wrangler was saying that he kept it just because he was trying to investigate uh, whatever was going on. So... I don't uh, think the he way meant he to... investigated. No, the way he investigated was he told us to quit our jobs. Yep. That that is. I was there for that. Yep. Okay. Well, there you go. All right. Uh, I think we've got everything that we can get. Um, okay. Like I said, if if you receive further contact, more notes, more anonymous calls, just document relay to one of the you know me tessa flop carter um thank you i appreciate it and we'll uh we'll dig into this to the best that we can mm -hmm. all right ranger squad let's roll well ranger plus lsbd squad let's roll in. yeah me yeah yay yeah. all right y'all really appreciate you guys thank you yep no worries absolutely oh excuse me sorry about that all right. Okay. No oh, shit out here running deep, dog. What the fuck? <laughs> God damn. Oh, God. <laughs> is so jump. scary in this car. What, what do you mean he's scary? Scat, he's scat, just scat, right in my face. Dog. Oh, yeah. He's there so he can get head scratches and yeah. whatnot. That does the same thing. I think we need to get the canine thing in here. So oh, glad have the, uh, does this oh, have a canine yeah. thing? Uh, that is a good question. So uh, I gotta run. File these notes. What's the report number for this? So I can file these notes under it. Uh, so I was gonna generate a new report for this. Uh, okay. I will send you over my notes to see if there's anything that I wrote down that you want to supplement into yours. <laughs> Uh, okay. let's just get to MRPD so and see if we can get Look at his uh, little face. The bucket seat scooped back there for, I love um, him. for Scout. His little ears. Um, so generally speaking, Carter, these, uh, <laughs> these sorts of, like, serial attacker folks, uh, they, they follow a pattern. Uh, we're kind of in uh, phase one of creepy serial killer nonsense right now, which is where they're just kind of making contact and being creepy. Oh, okay. Um, we actually cannot scoop the seat out of this thing. Interesting. Okay. Weird. Uh, here, let me send you my notes. It's probably for the best that we pick this up over uh, Wrangler, though. I know he doesn't, he's not a huge fan of long-term serial killer-esque investigations. It's not everybody's cup right, of tea. Perfect. You should have those. Um, yeah, so generally phase one is where they're, they're, they're stuck, right? They have selected their targets. Uh, in this case, it seems to be medical professionals, which, oh joy. Uh, Way to shoot fish in a barrel with that what? one, creepy serial Scout. killer person. You're selecting a group of individuals who are largely stationary, uh, who you can <laughs> watch. Yeah, who, who are literally not allowed Boop. to carry firearms. Good for you. Um, yeah, it's what happens when you can't, decide to tell people can't you can't carry guns. Yeah. You get targeted. I can boot Bundy. Um, phase two is going to be whenever they start actually Boop. procuring a couple of targets. They they usually don't leave too many identifying factors Boop. during that, but. Uh, between phase one and phase two is when they start leaving calling cards. Um, so we'll notice commonalities between so scenes. Uh, uh, like, um, slow it down. Slow it down. Slow Wait, it what do you down. mean, slow it down? You're the one you're, going through the red you're light. You're going through a red. You're going through a red. Nah, oh, you're going through a red. Look at it. 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 Right there. What's that color? What's it's, red, it's red now. It was green when we were going look at through my, it. Look at my color. Look at my color. That was red when you started this sentence. 
Ah, uh, okay. Now all of a sudden, it's when I started the sentence, you know. And then if I shoot somebody, it's oh, you shot a cop. It, you know, it's. Uh, well, well, what the heck? That's not even stop? related. Okay, and neither is peas and apples. Well, sometimes you gotta have apples with your peas. You know what I'm saying? Alright, guys, have a good one. Love you. Ew. What? What? It's okay. I flicked them off. Heck yeah. Um, so yeah, phase phase two, they're going to start procuring targets, but they will begin leaving, uh, calling guards on scenes, you know, <laughs> things drawn on the scene, specific styles of note. This person is probably going to leave a lot of photographs since they've already started off with that. Um, and then phase three is where they're still procuring targets, but they're getting fucking sloppy about it. Um, you know, they're allowing themselves to be seen in public more. They're making phone calls either with their own phone or with a burner phone that they don't get rid of. And that's where we really genuinely have a chance to catch these individuals. Um, there's a lot of stuff. Matt, we can kind of crack down on it a little bit now that we, uh, like, so for instance, let's, let's go do a quick patrol around the hospital. Okay. Um, you know, we know what their target pool is. We know they're going Promoto. after doctors. Uh, Why is it? Yeah, I know they're going after Dolly and Jeffy, but we also Why is it that I doctors. always find you locked in the cells so at Mr. OPD? If I see somebody wearing a Why mask does that happen to us? Or somebody who is, uh, you know, in a being weird. Yeah, unusual. It's always you. So it's always you. What is it about you that lets you get, get locked in the cells like that? Yeah. <laughs> Every time, dude. You know, there was at least two serial killer cases that Hayes closed that I did traffic stops on before they were ever caught. <laughs> oh, for real? Yeah. You know, oh, that's crazy. <sighs> they already had profiles, and they would have like I don't know, negligent driving or third degree speeding or some nonsense. Micah, like that thank you for the gift of Sabdekermoto. I appreciate it. I mean, at the end of the day, it all kind of cracks. And Galactic Dork, controller. thank you for the five gifted. Or no, I'm sorry, the five months. Sorry. Alright. I'm cooked. I'm sorry, chat. It's interesting that we have a BMX bike left outside the morgue. Speaking of being cooked, I don't know whether I said thank you to Mizo for the 41 months. Thank you, Mizo. Uh, where is this home that she... She said picture perfect drive six. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Hey, so, uh, so for the report, did you already put the report up? No, 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 I haven't. Uh, I haven't put any report up. I just shot you my notes that way. Yeah, I'm looking. I was looking. Um. Oh, weird. Her house doesn't work with the GPS. That's interesting. All right. So are we going to a cur current residence right now? Yeah, we're going to head up to uh, the, the residence that she shares with uh, with Jeffy, where they've been finding these notes at, just to kind of scout it out and see what kind of landscape we're looking at. And okay. Typically what I'll do during these early phases, because uh, let, uh, let's be honest, you got about a 1 in 100 shot of catching whoever's doing this this early on. Um, and even if you do catch them, what am I going to slap them with? Harassment and stalking and send them up yeah. to Bolingbrook for 14 months and then they get cut loose? That's uh, not, you know, it's not, not yeah, it's not really going to disincentivize their conduct. Um, I might be able to strip them of any weapons licenses or anything for the criminal threats, but that's about it. Um, Nothing significant. 
but I can at least start kind of getting a gauge on how they might be thinking, right? Like if I patrol this area up here, it's like, okay, that's a good rooftop for them to sit on if they wanted to watch it. Uh, yeah. I don't really think about it so much as like getting in the mind of the killer necessarily. I think of it more like, uh, you know, if I was staking out a 37, like how would I stake this location out, you know? Gotcha. Tessa, do you remember which uh, which house it was? Uh, the one that got shot up last night was actually the one in the south side. Oh, strangely enough, okay. um, I don't know. I don't know if any of it's happened at this house. Oh, I see. Yeah, that so, was over on. Can I ask you a question, uh, Bundy? Do you sit on the regular radio? Uh, yeah, yeah, I do. Oh, shit. Okay. Still having uh, Carlson, I'm not here. currently because we just, uh, we just got out of that meeting with them. But... I mean, that was a super reckless landing. Investigation always comes with some degree of having to figure out which calls are necessary to go to and which can be ignored so visual on a got you yeah like if it's the third chase with tony corleone that's popped off over the last 45 minutes then i'm probably going to ignore it and, uh if it's you know something a little more pressing like a 37 alpha or a bank that doesn't have enough units or definitely a 78s call um you know that's the type of stuff you, you got to break for regardless mm. okay all right Because again, we're kind of in our baby phases on this one anyway, right? So. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. All right, let's uh, let's roll down here to this uh, the south side home. This one's this is an interesting photograph because this looks like it was taken from just in the middle of the damn road. Honestly, Pho the which photograph yeah, are you referring to? There's a train track. Which photograph are you referring to? Um, that first report that uh, Tessa and Flop wrote, I referenced it at the top of my notes, uh, 77316. I thought you were talking about the recent one, 7. I think I regained visual on Frogger, northbound over the Alamo Sea, near Sandy Shores. Tessa, tell me if I'm wrong in thinking this, but looking at the height that that photograph was taken from, does that look, does that look like it was taken uh, from a vehicle while they were sitting in the middle of the road? And... It's possible. Maybe. Possibly. I don't know. I know that that road. So if we go over here, right? Uh, Cause our cameras are kind of funny. They sit above our head. So if you make a left and you see this little divot next to the garage right here on the left. Back up, uh, back up, back up, back up, back up, straight back. Yeah, we're at back the uh, back. You see this little divot right here? Now, right by the oh, you think they were hiding in the bushes over here? Uh, it's not even in these bushes, but uh, yep, yep, yep. Let here, me know let me show you. I think the angle's we're wrong here. An hour, so once you get yeah, because they, they probably would have had right, both. Oh, I see what he's saying. Oh, <laughs> maybe. Yeah, where you get it straight on and you look, it looks like it's one railing, but it's actually both. One of them optical illusions. No, I think he's right. And... Yeah, no, 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 or, he's right. wait, no, 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 no. Inside of the parking right garage? He's like zoomed in somehow? Through the bars here. Because this is the house Hold up. Oh, 
I thought it was more raised. Maybe on the step. A uh, picture left in mailbox seven seven three one six. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, like down here, if they were standing in between those bars just to get the perfect photo, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or um, say he set up like I don't know. Maybe he puts a car down here. Right? Yeah, I went inside of here too, and I checked. It, it's about even with this level. They could have gotten a car in in there. And had it been a lot uh, less conspicuous. Like either way, somehow he, so he took a picture because from right yeah. here, from what I'm saying, so if you right stand like right about here, entrance. this is about the angle. Up road towards LS stairs, eastbound. Is there one of these on the other side? Hmm. Heading northbound uh, now. I don't know. Towards uh, satellite. Yes, there is. Okay. What if this is uh? What if this is gang related? Is this uh, is this still is this still like turf for anybody? You know, there is a little divot on that side as well. Okay. Yeah. And this trench too. Yeah. Interesting. Cause that's her, that's the house so, across the street, directly across the street to the right. They the, said this um, was dock block, so there's a bunch of doctors that live on this whole row. So, yeah. if it's gang related, wouldn't they be going after all of the doctors rather than her specifically? Well, they could be, but they could just be starting with these two, right? And, uh, cause they, they're Maybe. also targeting Jeffy. Um... Uh, back up really quick. I just want to see what angle this was taken at. Yeah, right here is the angle. Right here. It's this yeah. house right here, dead on. Yeah, so it would have had to be like inside the trench right there. Yeah. I'm saying they put a car in the garage there and stood on it and did it through the bars. So, in fact, I think even how the way this picture is taken, he cuts it off at the bottom, so we don't actually know exactly where. They could have also put a card down in here and done the same thing. Either way, it's... I wouldn't risk getting my car stuck, though, if I was stalking someone like you that. You could probably, uh... I mean, if it's a, if it's a stolen car, it doesn't matter. You well, you still have to walk or... away from it. Nah, but you see this, uh... You see where the, uh... You can go into the, the parking structure right there. So you could never be seen. So if you go down here, you make a right, you can go out oh, into that divot again, or into that trench again, where this G is to the left. So you have this doorway. So, I mean, you can get it stuck all you want to and come back to another car. I don't know that you would be able to cleanly snap well no actually no, zoom zoom, in. zoomed zoom in, in from right here yeah. yeah and then you can take it to uh, a clear picture yeah this is just about perfect car might have been a little taller uh, than what ours is but... yeah personally i think this was it yeah i think you're right so yeah maybe he doesn't even get out or he's not even on the open or if he does get out. yeah there's no way it's not had to be. They cropped it. Oh, that is sneaky as all the hell. I don't like that at all. Yay, I helped. Fuck yeah. Okay. Um, what about those other notes? Uh, what do, what kind of angle are we looking at for the photos of Jeffy from, uh, from prison? Uh, I have to look at him. Give me a sec. Oh, you're good. I'll start driving us up that way. I you're gonna think I'm the biggest nerd because I drive everywhere in the city. What do you mean? Did uh, you know locations I'm, and stuff? I know like I took a test and I know like 85% of the city. Yeah. Just by looking at shit. I think a lot of and, us are like that. And uh yeah. for me, it's areas up north. Um 
you could send me a picture of something, and I probably could tell you where it's taken from, just based on the grass. Pretty much the only Which is thing really, that's really the, uh, you say based on the ground on the grass. Yeah. Stop. That's based how I got milk caught. I remember that actually. Yeah, you were uh, you were calling out that it had to be uh, like around uh, the Sonora Way area. <laughs> I knew exactly where it was, just on the the color of the dirt. Yeah, that dude. Uh, so you're, out you're a photo in good that had like, he had a he had a corner of a fence in it and like a patch of dirt, and Tesla was like, I know where that fence and that dirt are. I'm not like that up north, uh, in the city, basically anywhere along the street. Uh, yeah. I can I can pretty much look at. What the heck? And uh, I'm determine where that shit is. Oh man, chat, we're dipping below two hours down, almost. Except for the, we're dipping. Uh, the Vinewood Hills and like uh, like that that region kind of behind there. With times all the five. You think we need to do like times Bay five? Oh, like Baytree, ba Galileo, yeah. West Galileo. A lot a lot of that stuff blends together for me, but north uh, and be, south of that, I'm good. Yeah, uh, I'm pr I'm pretty pretty glad about that i think uh by the way i think the i might be convinced of this, of this uh of these I pictures might be is gonna be like north of the prison okay. north really okay is he like uh, in the yeah. parking lot or is he okay. hello bowling rook i just received a call from bowling rook and then they hung up yeah, so he might even be... <laughs> They're holding up for the times five. That's fine. How about this? How about we... Be on this side of the how about we do this? Dishes? All right. If we get to 1,400, that's four right, subs away. I'll put on the, uh, the times five timer. You told how me you last like night you were apps. committed to the bit. What is this? <laughs> so look. Even her out for me, chat. <laughs> oh, Greg, thank you. <laughs> All right, hold off, chat. Hold on. Um, no question mark. Let me, uh, oh, no, hold on. This is me. Hold on. <laughs> let me, let me update the timer. I think it's this building. I think he stands on top of this building. This is me. Thank you for the four gifted as well. Ten times? No, nah, the, the deal was five, all right? <laughs> 134 for the timer? Okay. Okay. I'll make it 140. Tessa and Larry Andrews know that you are available for, that. for chores and such. I'm talking to you soon. I will do... So the thing that I find the most interesting about the fact that he was photographed from prison yeah. is the fact that they knew he was in prison. Hold on, I'm updating the timer oh stuff. God. Spinning out, out of control, right. Uh, westbound occupation. Didn't save the numbers. Hold on. There's one more and then a channel. Left, found Las Lagunas. Okay, so. We change it to 180. No, that's why did I do times three? South on Peaceful Street, right west. We put 300. Uh, Vespucci going under La Puerta, left southbound Calais. 600. Left into the construction site on Calais. And 1200 was the other one. They are driving to the back, crashing into everything. Channel one for this 80. Right. The vehicle's uh, continuing north, coming out back onto Calais, heading north. Channel back 1 for that 80. There we go. Channel 1. It is now five times. Yeah. 
There we go, chat. It's active. Trev, thank you for the sub, by the way. Minria, thank you for the 10 gifted. That's a whole hour. Oh my god. <laughs> Slipliner coming in with the 10. Land with the, the 5. Thank you guys so much. He was in hype train. I'm getting hype for the five times. Of it he was going Trinity's with the 10. You're amazing. Or Thank you. It's happening. It's happening. Or lawyer or something like that. Or they were actively stalking them. Uh, World said hi. Thank you for the 10 as well. Them and saw Wrangler pull them over. Saw Jeffy get put in the cuffs. Yeah, that means they saw me as well. That because, was there for that whole stop. Because if if your target is a doctor from the Los Santos Medical Group, why the fuck would you be checking the newspaper to see if they went to jail? Could do ten Absolutely. times for one minute no, at some know. point, see what happens. Maybe. So we'll see. Your guesstimation is he was being. Mr. Waddlington coming through with the five that, gifted uh, as well. Thank you so much. Yeah, I think that Mizo with the gifted as well. She said, "What coming in with the five? Thank you, thank you guys." Okay, now I'm trying to think. Pumping the timer. Oh, I get some. Okay. Somebody leaking that information and then them scrambling in enough time to come take the photo is a flashback. One second. Uh, I do remember a black stratum on that stop that passed by. Is it a random What's sub or to someone specific? Yeah, where? Rampage Dinosaur coming in with the five as well. Thank you so much. Puts you at 69 total for the channel. Nice. I didn't get You're a look at him, but I did. I do remember a black stratum passing by. It's gonna be flag. Oh, never mind. That was a vehicle behind us. Tessa, you were saying something about Doc Block. Uh, so yeah, basically they have a bunch of doctors on that block, so they're calling it Doc Block. It's like their little turf, I guess. Um, so I don't think it's. I feel like it's not a gang. But, I, I don't know. Because normally if it's gang activity, it's like... I don't know, they they very specifically make sure that they know it's because you're in a gang, right? Yeah. Otherwise, it's kind of yeah. like you're being a wussy, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah no, I, think, would, uh, I think a gang would be a lot more upfront about telling them yeah. to pay taxes or leave the area or... Some extortion in there, some shit. Yeah. That's what yeah. makes me yeah. think it's not... I think you're right. Mm. Astropolophagus, thank you for the five gifted. You're amazing. Jeffy's just a doctor, which means... Um, I did my gifted, and then... SA, thank you for the five as well. And Danomite, thank you for the ten gifted. Wolfkiss, thank you for the ten as well. You saying Doc Block kind of got me on that train of thought, but there's been a couple of doctors who have been sacked recently, haven't there? Um, not to my knowledge. I, um, I mean, Lennon might know better than I do. I know that, um... Oh, man, chat. Back at 1500. I, I know Fitzpatrick was fired a couple of months back, like a month and a half, two months uh, ago. Cobra Knight, thank you for the five. Get to Toronto for the five. Thank you so much. Rampage Dinosaur, thank you for the additional gift. a little delayed to seek, uh... I don't know. Again, Doc Block is with the blocks, so I think they would also be a little more upfront about their stuff and a little zanier with their plans, maybe. Um, and Fitzpatrick, I mean, the only thing that I can think about her is that, uh, to the best of my knowledge, she was let go due to her associations outside of the hospital that were bringing danger in. What about that person? And, like, insubordination. Um... This would be a pretty slow cook for her to suddenly decide that she's going to go all haywire against all the doctors. This person, I wonder... So, Frazier saw a black banshee, you saw a black stratum. This person's definitely stealing cars. Uh, it passed by us. The reason why I remember it, they actually said something. They may not even be related, but I, I don't know. It, it's 
it's very interesting to to see that now because I just don't think. I guess when dealing with this, I shouldn't believe in anything coincidental. Hmm. Oh my gosh. Unless you have a different mindset on that. Sunak coming in with the 20. Uh, no, if they spoke up that, well, I don't know, because they could be getting... What a hype things, train, right? guys. If they're getting ready oh to my take gosh. their first victim, then <laughs> they could Haven't be done in that, that in a while. Well, it is appreciated. Thank you so much, Sunak. What they is nobody's quite onto them yet. Yeah. Um... Yeah, these psychos tend to like... Uh, Arctic, thank you for the 10 so, months. Steffer, um, thank you for the 10 gifted as well. But if it just drove by, shouted something, and then kept going, then eh, maybe not. I'm wondering if that lady... Uh, it wasn't a drive-by. It was more like they kind of... They were doing the speed limit. Nobody does the speed limit, as sad as to say. she have anything um, to do with the doctors, maybe? Because she's out on parole. It, it wasn't even out loud that I could hear him. I could just hear him having a conversation. This is me. Thank you for the biddies. Siley, thank you for the 21 months. Okay, now that makes it more what likely, a heck in because it's train. very likely that we're dealing with at least two individuals based on the note being left at the property. Jeffy says he got out of jail, so he walks out of the front uh, front visitation area. Picture is taken, and before he even gets to impound, the photograph is left in his mailbox. So either we're looking at a speed demon who shot it all the way down, which isn't a great thing to do when you're stalking somebody. You don't want to be going 100 miles an hour down the road. Um, or we're looking at two individuals. We got somebody on top of this mm -hmm. roof, and then we've got somebody who's ready to receive and deliver the message. So that makes the stratum a lot more likely. It's, I would say we're probably dealing with two or more individuals. Got you. Uh, let me take this call. What's up, Rosa? What's up? What was your What was your thought process, Tessa? You started saying something. Well, I noticed the other day that there was somebody with uh, bank tracking on them uh, when Poppy Monroe. Uh, they're on parole for 54,000 months right now for a serial assaults and killings scenario. Um, it, it's the only person that I know that's in circulation right now that's doing anything, and I don't know what her deal was so i'm looking at her reports right now to see if there's any uh you know potential uh, for like weirdness uh and i did notice there's a note in the raid stuff and it's a little bit medical uh in nature and i don't know It just got me thinking. I mean, I, it's a stretch, but somebody maybe to think about. Yeah, it could be somebody to keep an eye on. I'm just trying to think of anyone who's in circulation. I don't know of any. I mean, I had my stalker, too. I, I wouldn't want to rule him out, but. Uh, in my knowledge, he might be dead. So that's why he's not exactly a suspect. Uh, yeah. Interesting. Keep alive, heated blade, break down, rusty tools, tooth extraction, spin <laughs> Oh my again. gosh, you guys are crazy. Uh, correct. Thank know, you for the five gifts. seems like, she, I mean, you know, obviously prison and being apprehended changes people. Oh. Uh, give me a second. Hello? Ranger, uh, warden, fuck. Tess up. It's, it's Craig. Oh, I'm sorry, hey. to bother you. I'm sorry. I'm just really stressed out. And I could use a favor if at all possible, and I don't Man. expect you to follow through in this. I'm just. No, you're doing fucking good. Losing get, my uh, fucking report, mind in here. Together, you ride, uh, what's the uh, what's the, up, the favor? If you happen to go up north, can you can you check in Mojito? See if they have I any gotta be real with you, man. You take way better notes than I do. See, something see if they have any what? To life. Any other gumbo? I'll pay you back. You... I just, I need, I need something, something relatable to like life right now. I'm just, I'm so stressed out. I'm not entirely sure I can there. get that past the uh, corrections officers. I don't know if they'll be upset about that. No, they, they usually offer to go get it for me. They just, it's never open when they're up there. 
I see. I just, okay. How long are you going to be around long, for? Uh, for a good while. Okay. I'm still... Uh, they, they shut down my plea agreement, and I don't know what's wrong. I haven't heard anything in 48 hours, and the last I heard is no, no agreement. Something's got to be rewritten, but the lawyer... The officer, nobody will get in contact with me. I don't know what's going on. I've been in here for 15 years, and I don't know what's happening. Okay. I just need something. Something. Well. Just... Uh, Sorry. the gumbo you said. Yeah. All right. I will do what I can for you. Um. I don't know if I can do it right now or right this instant, but I will see if I can get some. Um, is there anything I can do about your plea agreement? I have no idea. Who's who's been handling it? Oh, my head. Um, Norman Adams. Put your head down. Who's my lawyer? Max Muller. Who's the prosecuting officer? Okay, Loki. I'm embarrassed about my notes, man. Did I just throw yours in there? Like, Sorry, I'm having a hard time hearing you, Craig. Sorry. Uh, um, you said Norman, Norman Adams? Adams? Yeah, he's my lawyer. Max Muller, who's the prosecuting officer, and Judge Alan Crane, who is the presiding judge over my case. Okay. And All right. I'm just not getting any communication. I just don't know what to do. I was supposed to get out today. And the last I heard was that well, I was supposed to, sorry, I was supposed to get out yesterday on bail or on bond and or whatever parole. God, my brain is such a fucking mess right now. And it's not not happening. And I don't know what to do. Okay. Um has anything been just, put on the docket for your situation that you're aware of? Uh, the last update was Monday, which was the plea agreement that myself, my lawyer, and Max Muller had signed, and the judge denied it. Do you have and any idea why? I, I don't know. The lawyer won't tell me. I can't access it from the prison because it's it's a sealed docket, and so the Wellingbrook computers won't access it. So I have to go to my lawyer, okay. who won't answer my calls, and I can't get a hold of him. Something about the fine? I... I don't know. Okay. I'll, uh, I'll see what I can poke around at. See if I can get you an answer. I appreciate it. I'm, I'm sorry All to right. bother you. I, I know okay. you've got to be super busy with your new position. Just... Well, believe it or not, you're not the first one with an issue like this. So I'll, uh, I'll figure it out for you, okay? I appreciate it. I, I, I don't... I'm not going to hold you to it. I... I, I don't... I don't deserve the deserve that kind of attention, but I, I do appreciate any amount of effort you put in. Well, regardless of whatever you might have done, you do have rights. So whatever's going on, I need to figure out why it's happening. And if it's an issue, then we need to get to the bottom of it. So that's the end of the story. Thank you. I I would do that for anybody, and uh, it's not really just a you thing, but. I, because you're you, uh, I will definitely want to look into it. Yeah. Thank All you, right. Jessica. I'm gonna stop being a phone guy. I'll, I'll get to the bottom of it and I'll <laughs> see what I can do about your gumbo, okay? All right. Thank you, Tessa. No Don't problem. Stay safe. I make no such okay. promises. Goodbye. <laughs> Bye. I'm sorry, guys. No, you're good. And <laughs> Tessa, I've been there. Uh, well, yeah. Half the time, I'm still there on the phone. Well... Craig wants some gumbo from, uh, Mojito, but... I don't know if I can get that to him. have to check the docket on that one because if there's no docket post then we have another issue which I don't really know what to do about uh hopefully there is one though I would imagine for that case there was
Yeah, 10, 11, and a, oh, what in the hell? Um, I'm not seeing any inj injured individuals, but I see two illegally parked cars we can circle back around to. Well, do you want to see if uh, see if Scout can uh, sniff anybody out where we got that 47? Thank you, Rashad. What do you say, Scout? You want to do it for old time's sake? Come on, buddy. All right. Smell the thing. Yep. That's a wall. Are they inside the wall, boy? I... Um, actually, while we're here, I'm gonna check inside the store. Hey, which one is... which one of these... Uh, hey, Carter, I'm gonna put Scout in the car. And I'm gonna help Bundy go check in here. Ready for a channel? Anything? Uh, continuing eastbound, uh, right, southbound. That one. Towards Boulevard Del one Perro, down right here. Westbound. Right northbound, Morningwood. Left westbound, Perth. Left southbound, South Rockford Drive. Right Four westbound, Four Boulevard Del Perro. San Andreas State Park Rangers. Anybody in here all injured and whatnot? Right. Try out in pain if you are. Street. Right eastbound. Primary 50 BCB, continuing east, Cougar. Mercade, right where? Just beneath your bones. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. I didn't know this was here, dude. Uh, they have DDR. Yeah, I think we're good. Bro, that's so cute. I love it. High speeds, he's found a Boulevard de Perro. Merging on to Hallwick now. Alright, everybody go channel one press oh, the plus. Well, I'll be right there. What, what the hell happened? Oh, comms. No one has eyes, right? What's this? Okay. Okay, I'll you just do a tracker comm. Channel one. Down there. Channel one. Channel one. Uh, my daughter was shot in the back, and of course, Colin McKinley's goddamn bank tracking is going off during an S++ boost. Sounds about right. Hey, what's Colin wanted for? Uh, terrorism. Still? Yeah, he's been on the run for oh a while. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I also haven't, uh... Last time I heard from him was on his birthday, like, three weeks ago, so... Yeah, I definitely saw him on a beach, the, uh, like, when they were doing some kind of event. Yeah, that and, was probably, uh, probably for his birthday. Nancy told me that they were probably yeah. going to get up to some wacky stuff. Okay, so... Well, if you saw him on the beach, why didn't you arrest him, Tessa? I was off duty. Oh, well, that's a good excuse. I like that. He also didn't show up until the end of the event, so I went straight to mission roll afterwards and reported it. Uh, but apparently Cleo got shot. Uh, code 60 area, so you can... uh oh. Yeah, uh, what do I title this report? Uh, what is the report about? This, uh, investigative report that is linked to 77. Uh, 
whole situation is what I'm talking about, Tessie. I would say, stalk, like, call it, um, like, her name and then stalker. As long as you have the other report numbers referenced in it, it should be fine. It's called Dahlia Stalker. Yeah. I'm gonna go inside. The upstairs. Well, anyway, well, I have a second chat. Thank you so much for that push. You guys are amazing, as always. Um, Mythic Mexican, thank you for the seven months. Minria, thank you for the ten gifted. Land for the five, you're amazing. Uh, Stepworth for the hundred biddies. Nosla, thank you for the four months. Uh, Wizard, thank you for the six months. Sir Pieces, uh, thank you for the prime. Let's see, did I miss any? Uh, Stony McWheels, thank you for the, uh, biddies. Correct, thank you for the five. I think that's all caught up. But that was amazing, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and reset the thing again. Hey, Tessa. Hey, I'm sorry I didn't call you back. I didn't forget about you. It's just been really hard for me to get a second of like anything. Mm, you forgot about me. I didn't. Ooh, you resting some scumbags? Uh, no, not right now. I don't know if there's any available. You want me to check on uh, the channel? You okay? Noise. I'm good. I just seen a bandage about us go by one. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, don't worry about it. I got it all taken care of. Oh, good. I'm glad. So, yeah. So, this, this clock's, you know, acting out of pocket. Oh, you know, you know how he is. He was writing um, bullshit warrants and stuff, so I had to call up Crane. <laughs> is that so? Yeah, he was he put fucking a warrant out for me, and uh, yeah, I, I had to get it deleted. What's interesting is I had Vinny call me for the same exact oh, thing. Uh, well, uh, you know, Vinny kind of is just kind of dumb, so I think Vinny. Well, yeah, I uh, he called me for one warrant, and then uh, turns out he had two warrants. Yeah, pretty much. Um, yeah, pretty much. Clone Conan gave me a warrant that was meant for him. But he just gave what? it to me too. Just, uh, it was meant for Vinny? Yeah, pretty much, you know, uh... Vinny made him fall off a pole. That's it. Oh. But I blame his weight and balance, so... I mean, that could be awkward in court. Now, me, I was just watching, so... I think he just got mad that I laughed at him. You know, that's reasonable. Oh, you know... I had to get that cleared up, and we're all good now. Okay, well, I'm glad it worked out. Sorry about that. You know, uh, I'm I'm pretty hard to get a hold of right now, and this is honestly the the first five minutes of respite that I've had in the last four and a half hours. So respect. Uh, respite, respect. like uh, you know. I don't know what the space fuck that word between, means. Between <laughs> space between chaos. Respite. Yeah. I've never heard of that in my life. It's like a pause. Resplate. That's crazy. That's crazy. I haven't, I haven't heard a new word in a long time. Uh, apparently, I tend to do that. I don't know why. Sorry. A lot of people seem to know about this word if I was imagining. What the hell? How do I not know about this word? It's okay. I got somebody with the oh word asinine the other dumb. day. What word? Asinine? Asinine? I know that word. Yeah. 
Don't ask me what it means, though. I'm not too sure. I like to use the word cantankerous, too. It's a fun one. I never heard of that shit. What about kerfuffle? Is it kerfuffle? Uh huh, kerfuffle. I've heard of that. I don't know what that means, though. Like a, a scuffle, like a fight, a shuffle, uh, oh, yeah, a mischief. That makes sense. So, Mr. And then, for example, you would say, yo, Carter's asinine. What the heck? <laughs> well, that's kind of right? rude. Is that using it right? Yeah. No, no. no. I think asinine is like, um, ridiculous, pointless, yeah, ridiculous. Uh, uh, extra. Uh, radio check. It's, it's kind of a rude Anyone word to use to towards somebody else. It's like, it's like saying they're stupid, right? Uh, not necessarily stupid uh, no, in that not, context. Yeah. It's more like... Uh, it, it, it does more feel like it's more of like... It's ridiculous. Right, it's absurd. It's not necessary. Yeah, absurd, that's a good one. Copy yeah, you're absurdly... One. ...dumb. You're asinine, Carter. Well, asinine that's, that's just that rude. Wow, that is... It's a lot, Mr. K. What's going on with you, though? What you been up to, man? I'm just, you know, going through a little respite right now. Oh, yeah? <laughs> okay. Yeah, you know, it's just... Honestly, I've been just trying to get my court case to happen. Honestly, that's what I've been doing, but... Oh, word? Okay. These fucking judges. I don't, I don't know what the fuck they're doing. I've been at a... There's been, just been a lot going on with it's the docket lately. days since the judges looked at that shit? No, it's been 12... We've been waiting 12 days for them to assign a judge. Oh, so I'm saying, so I'm like, well, how would hold on? Why well, does it take so long just to say, all right, boom, this is the judge, and then we can figure out the scheduling? Yeah, uh, I have you to know? think. Was I involved in anything you did? Uh, I could look. Hold on, let me see. I got it right. Yeah, tell me if I was involved, and maybe a judge will come around. Nine three three. Okay, thank you, Tato. Let me get this fixed. 16, 120, and 250. I don't think I was. I don't remember arresting you. I don't see your name listed anywhere. It's about the uh, the island grow. Oh, no. Never mind. Nope. You were? Yeah, I was definitely involved oh. in that shit. 308-1038 Westbound Vespucci Boulevard across the street from... Well, certainly was. All right. Well, I'm, I'm Timer is now fixed. Shit. I'm just getting charged with witness tampering, kidnapping, petty theft, and act of torture. But Damn. They threw me on the same docket. Oh, my God. Uh, I what? guess because they're charging me with witness tampering of one of the witnesses of that the boys' uh, cases. So, huh. So you got looped in with that. I got looped in, though. So I don't think they're going to do mine separate. The, are you getting hit with the drug trafficking? No, no. That's what I'm saying. Maybe, like, Wait. like why can't mine just be said? Why don't you... Uh, who's your lawyer? Murphy, Mickey, and Rosa. Okay. What you need to do is tell them ask for a separation. Because you had no, if you if you had nothing to do with that, you're not getting charged with the I drugs. I think they tried, but they're saying because the witness is one of the witnesses involved in this <laughs> other <laughs> If it was case, Norman again, I know. <laughs> I mean, you still ask for a separation. Oh, you man. Know, did they try right, and put in Stepper, one? by the way, thank you for the gifted subs. I appreciate you. Because if you're not getting charged with, like, the actual drugs and themselves. That was an awesome push, guys. I appreciate it. Rosa, um, I was talking to a few All cops, right, and they were suggesting there. that uh, with our case, we asked Carter. for um, it was like 160 and, you know, plus yes, subs. You know, okay, give him some credit here. Yeah, we asked for a separation of our, no, our cases I'll, I'll since my charges aren't directly involving the boys' charges. The only thing that combines it is uh, that they're claiming I witness tampered okay. with one of their witnesses. If that will help with getting it done faster since I'm on bail and shit, you know? I'm not... So, I'm gonna say... I'm gonna say this after you're done on the phone. Yeah, let's do that then. Okay. Yeah, let's get all that rolling and let me know. No they raided him? 
Oh, all right, B. All right. All right. All right, sounds good. All right. So yeah, she said she's going to try to do that. She's yeah. saying she thinks it uh, is taking so long because no one wants to touch it because of the whole Maldini's thing involved with it. Oh, uh, that's dog uh -huh. shit. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't uh, know. The uh, that that's I, I don't the reason well, pretty for much the, the separation... cops are trying to take Maldini's and Dodo. Uh, I don't know. Okay, that's incredible. That has nothing to do with anything. Okay, anyways, um, so the reason why you asked for a separation is because you're not you're you, Mr. K, are not being charged with drug trafficking, are you? No, no, no. When is yeah. tampering, kidnapping, no, 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 no. act? So yeah, if you're not being charged with the initial crime. Or you're not ha you don't have any association with the initial crime. You simply were like threatening witnesses. Yeah, that's totally separate. Now, okay. Now, I don't does know. the original case have to happen beforehand to prove the credibility of those witnesses? Excuse me, guys. Me sorry. Hello? Hey. Hello. Hey, no, where's hey, Tessa? Hey, Tessa. How's it going? Uh, it's going all right. Um, sorry to bug you. I don't know if you're busy right now, but I uh. How did one of your clients reach out to me, uh, Craig Barrett? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah. kind of concerned about the status of his uh, plea deal, and I don't know um, what's going on with the docket situation. It appears to be sealed, so I don't really know uh, um, what the situation is. I don't want to pry too much into it, um, but he was concerned that his plea deal got rejected, uh, and he wants that yeah. resolved. Um, they, they weren't boosting a car. They were is there anything so you can do on your front? Or is it, there anything you need from us? We're working on it. Uh, kind of between Max Muller and I at the moment. Uh, he's the lead on the case. Um, there was a deal that was provided by Max. We agreed. And then obviously it was, uh, it was rejected by the Chief Justice given the nature of the charges. Um... He, he basically said no uh, because the fine was too low. Um, we're trying to figure out the numbers on it now. Um, the original plea agreement was for him to be in for 15 years. That 15th year would have been today. So I understand that that's why he's reaching out. Right. Um, I just haven't gotten a final number as far as the fine as to what would be acceptable, uh, you know, as far as, far as the, uh, you're waiting the DOJ on is concerned. Um, the Mueller judge? needs to come. I'm waiting on Max to come back with an offer. Um, he told me this morning that he was quote working on it. Um, but I haven't heard anything since I've only been around for, uh, okay. about an hour or so today. So, all right. I'm uh, not too sure he's around right now. Um, maybe it's a situation where he, he needs to be like prodded via email. I don't know. Um, but we're, we're kind of in a situation where we're having a lot of stuff get uh, neglected on the docket in various different ways, and I just want to make sure that everything's running smoothly, so, uh, I, th I think just trying to up communications on everyone's, uh, level is a probably just good in general. Oh, yeah. Um, uh, I have been in contact with, with Craig every day, um, okay. as, as this has all been going, um, there are just, uh, unfortunately, there's aspects that are sometimes out of my hands that I can't always deal with. Yeah, no worries. Um, so we are well, looking to have it done as quickly as possible. Um, but it's 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 a tough it's tough with the charges that even though he's pleading guilty and cooperating, it is a position where it's tough given the nature of what he's uh I understand pleading guilty to. So Okay. Um if you wouldn't mind maybe trying to reach out to him. I think he's awake right now in the, the prison. Um He'd, he'd probably would appreciate some kind of update. And I don't know yeah. enough about the situation to, to film in. So if you could, yeah, I had, that'd be great. Yeah, yeah. I had I spoke to him yesterday, last year. So I can ride up to Bowling Brook and have a chat with him. Yeah. Um, if you have time, that, we'll, that would be appreciated. Yeah, yeah. I definitely have time. I'll, uh, I'll head up there now. All right. Thank you, Norman. No problem. You take care, okay? You too. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay. How'd that go? Uh, no, it was cool. I mean, I, I just, I don't see why he's on the same case 
it's actually kind of it's like weird to me because because the way that's going to play out in court is right you're going to be trying a drug trafficking case and then you're going to say well he wit he he witness tampered like that from like in a, in a whole separate way so you have to tell you essentially have to tell two different stories in one case you know what i'm saying which can actually be a burden on the defense uh okay well could have left it but it's a, it's more of a ver burden on the defense to tell two different stories in one case rather than be sticking to one story yeah it makes it really hard but what's interesting is that case in and of itself, I have to talk to Bundy uh, and see what his thoughts are. If he asked for a separation, which case would strengthen the other? Because let's say those guys are found guilty of drug trafficking, right? Then it could actually in turn strengthen the case against Mr. K because they were found guilty of drug trafficking and he was trying to prevent them from being guilty of drug trafficking by tampering with witnesses. You know what I'm saying? But if mm -hmm. they find Mr. K guilty of tampering with the witnesses, then it would build a stronger case for the drug trafficking because it would prove that they're guilty because they tried to cover up the truth. Does that make sense? Yeah. So I don't know which one is actually stronger. I don't know either, to be honest. I, <laughs> I was, um, I was off duty that day. And I actually, yes, I, got a, I had a driving test with Mr. Eugene, and he basically filled me in on what was going on. Nice. So I had, it was another one of those situations where I was off duty, found something out. As soon as I was done, I had to go straight to Mr. Rowe and report it. Nice. Uh, I handled it's that insane. situation. Yep. I got to handle that situation. I was a part of it. It was wild. Yeah. There was a lot going on that day. That island was a death trap. You had to storm that bitch like fucking Normandy. <laughs> Crazy. <sighs> you legit had to mount an operation to take that island. What's Muller's thing? Oh, I found him. Okay. Message. Yo, what's Bundy into right now? I need to put these notes in the evidence locker for this shit because I don't want I don't want them lost. Also, Tessa, can you look at the report? Dahlia's stalker. You tell me if you that's a uh, up to standard from what y'all want. Yeah, I can take a look. Why not? Um, okay, Carter, are you done with your report? Uh, yeah, I was having Tessa look at it, and you can look at it and make sure. I mean, dude, you just take better notes than I did. I just threw your notes in there, dude. Like, I'm gonna be honest with you. <laughs> that's, that's usually what I do is just throw my notes in there. Okay. Um, the only thing I would no, you're, do you're... is uh, add the photos to the evidence. Okay, uh, I will do that. But as far as the report goes, is that solid? Uh, looks fairly detailed. I haven't gotten into the meat and potatoes of it, but let me see. This third note that you gave, is this? That's, that's note one number one, one that Wrangler took. Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, let's scooch out to the car real quick, because there's a scene that I want to go check or something real quick. Okay. Yeah, we can do that. I've got a hunch. Um... While y'all do paperwork, I'm gonna go diving. No, it wasn't the same day as the Skeleton I'll Pirates. It was um. Tessa will watch me do the paperwork. Hell yeah. It was the day we did Eugene's driving test. Yo, I appreciate you and letting me all... tag along and uh, learn the ropes. Um. On this. Hey, and they, been, they were doing the huge grow up you know, on an island and, and tweeting out pictures. Probably the only thing that I 
truly miss about that. Meanwhile, the Eugene thing, so was yeah. you know, being able doing to do a driving test with me and admitting that he had been there. He had the Boom. shotgun on him. I'll he you, like I'll tell you the reason why. <laughs> oh my god, he he insinuated a bunch of stuff. I want to push for I want a command position. I really want one. I really, really do. But um I find myself lacking experience and knowledge in this part of policing and so if i want to relate and understand my officers in the lspd that want to do this i want to be able hey, to pass up at least red alert i have your son at mission row doing. he has a warrant you know what i'm saying yeah 100%. my son yeah. has a warrant which your oh. son has a wolfenstein he is yeah, not son. my son wait did you get a DNA What's test? Your son, Game Warden. Uh, <laughs> you did? That is not did my she, son. Did she disown you? She's saying she doesn't even know who you are. I know who he is. He's not my son. He's my employee. Oh, he's your employee? Okay, okay. All right, well, listen, Tessa. Here's the deal. Here's the scoop, all right? Um, I'm going to be 100% honest with you. This warrant that was written up by Silas Grimmer for uh, Eric Wolfenstein, uh, report 77213, um, just doesn't like state, he said this basically states that Eric Wolfenstein pulled up to the traffic stop and his pastor, oh, and his pastor started yelling on. for Ricky Rouse to run from the traffic stop. Oh, Eric damn. then backed into Grimmer's Taurus, pushing it back and told Ricky <laughs> Rouse, now's your chance and drove off. Grimmer could not chase. Um, doesn't say like how he identified Eric or anything like that. The warrant's We're pretty uh, blackluster. I'm sorry, I just got a We're not going to talk about this. what just happened. Oh my god, are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> We're not going to talk about how we came to a complete stop and then We're flipped okay. over for some I just, reason. Uh, I need a minute to process what I just saw. Okay, okay. Um. Uh, I saw Bundy fly through the air like a Oh my a God, graceful he okay? eagle. He just got train track came. We can't lose him. He's okay. Okay. All Thank right. You. Anyway, I'm so Another sorry. I didn't hear a word of what fly. you said. Um, check out warrant seven seven two one three. And let me know what your thoughts are on this warrant. Oh. Oh my God. That was too funny. Oh my god, so, the ragdoll. <laughs> my concern with it, to, to let you know, is like, how did he? How did he identify Eric? Right? Does he know him? <clears throat> Does he? Has he interacted with him before? Has like, you know, like you have to have some sort of establishment on how you determine that that's. You know what I mean? Wolfenstein says he's never met Grimmer. Okay, well, Scout, I don't need your judgment. Um, like, did he recognize him? Have his plate? Yeah, that's um. This is not a good warrant. Uh, it's, it's not. And like, I, honestly, this like I'm pretty sure this dude's like never. Oh my god, oh, dude! It's arrested. If I'm correct on this, let me double check. I'm pretty sure. No, I he has. He has been. Um, he has been. Eric's been a bad boy. Uh, so what I would say is try to contact Silas, see if he can come into the city uh, okay. and defend his warrant. If not, if he doesn't want to do that, then I'm going to say that this is probably not enough to push. Okay. Uh, just, just based on the grounds that there's essentially zero evidence especially if he wants to contest it yeah it's pretty much a he said she said with no if, if it's said on here like <laughs> deputy grimmer has pulled over eric wolfenstein in the past and was able to recognize him from previous interactions he pulled up to a traffic stop and then did the rest that he wrote i think this this would be solid um yeah but there, but he's missing that articulation of how does he know eric wolfenstein? I swear to God, how did he safe. identify him yeah um so see if you can email him see if he can right. assist you at all uh if not then we're gonna have a we conversation have your permission with him to not 
push forward with it if he doesn't answer? Uh, if he doesn't answer, yeah. How long of a time frame should we give for something like that? Is he is down in the cells? Um, give him about, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes. About same, the same as time like for a, a, bench, a trial. bench trial. Yeah. Yep. I if agree. If he doesn't awesome respond testing. or anything, um, just say that you're marking the warrant uh, off. You're, you're disabling it. Yeah, uh, we have 60 days anyways. So if he wants to reestablish the PC, uh, yeah. he can. I mean, he's not been processed right now, so it's not double jeopardy. Okay. But we should be good. Awesome. Thank you. I was uh, brought to it by uh, the officer down here, and they asked me to take a look at the warrant. And yeah. If I was had stripes on my shoulders, I wouldn't have approved this warrant. I would. You no. sadly are the next. It's, uh, it's I hate not going enough. direct to you. That's not enough you know detail that. for a warrant. And I apologize for always having to come to you. Tessa, it's there's okay. no command that's, in between I'm us and you. What, that's what I'm here for. Okay. Also, You're I think best. Bundy is clearing. The humane labs by himself? I don't know what's happening. Okay, we'll go help him. Okay. Keep him safe. I'll talk to you soon. All right. Bye. All right, bye-bye. Where's Bundy? And why are we here? Carter? I don't know why he's in there by himself. What? Uh, he's doing this. <laughs> What's happening? Bundy! Ah, oh, we're good. I was, just, I was just going I was going off a hunch. I didn't think there was anything actually here. Yeah, I was diligently working and he went <laughs> I didn't even know where we were. Like sometimes sometimes I just do Bundy shit, okay? Um Cleo had a single gunshot wound to the back of the head. Uh she was handcuffed. Uh, and she had water. In this cuff timer by the time he gets to Mission Row. I know. Yeah, I it's not a big deal. I just want to make sure that the warrants that we're writing are, are valid. Yeah. And the last time that I investigated. Uh, and if that, that was, was to go to bench trial, we'd get Crane coming at us so, sideways again, you know? know. A warrant it's needs detail. It needs it needs to be a fleshed out things. description of events. It needs a lot in it in order to be a valid warrant. Because the fact I mean, of the matter is, is you are basically forcing point, someone but, uh, to evidence that exists has not be able to defend away. themselves against something that you have written, right? If the detail isn't there, the warrant should not be checked off as a warrant, because it's not ready. It should be able to paint the picture of what happened in explicit detail, not... not bullet points but very explicit detail um i'm probably gonna reach out to flop to see if he can pull a phone subpoena for cleo to try to piece together anything that we can of what happened but uh situations like this you know unless you uh unless you happen to have an officer or an ems stumble upon the original scene due to a 47 or something Looking for a needle and a stack of needles, so. Okay, all right, Scout, I'm sorry, I'll go. Scout is a very demanding boss, doesn't he? Absolutely. Yeah, he's got a lot of gripes. All right. Okay, we're good. We, uh, all the evidence is in the MBW. Heck yeah.
I'll be in my head, take a piss, and I'll be right back. Ew, did he say he was going to pee on his head? The heck, you hear that kitty cat? Here, kitty. Now, wherever that cat was, it sounded mad as all hell. Okay, so we reached out to Muller. I have, a, like, a never-ending to-do list. It's just piling up. Craig Barrett wants his plea deal. Emailed Muller. Uh. You doing okay, game warden? Hi. Uh, well, I was just thinking that I have a lot of things piling up right now that I. You think we could go to the Mojito Inn at some point today? Uh, I was actually getting ready to head off duty, so if you want me to flip us around, we can head up there now. I probably only got yeah. about uh, 20 minutes or so left in me, so... Alright. And for what it's worth, like I said, I've, I've been there before... I've got, uh, I've got faith that hopefully some of the stuff will come off your plate once the, uh, command structure is all delegated out and whatnot. Uh, right now I think you're just the last line of defense on shift two. And believe me when I say my condolences. It'll all, uh, well, it'll all shake out with the wash. It's one, uh, yeah, it's just... Sergeants and I wish... About. wish I could do more, like, right away, rather than just having to let it pile up and wait. You know? Yeah, no, I got you. And we'll start by going to the Mojito Inn. That'll be one box checked off. Yeah. And for what it's worth, on the ranger end, I think you've uh, you've picked a lot of self-driven individuals who uh, are kind of uh, taking care of their taking care of their own business and asking one another questions and leaning on each other like the circle of folks that we are. So. Okay, um, my to-do list I'm writing down. 
We've got Craig Barrett wanting the plea deal. We have Cosby and Royal harassing Andy and Pilbus. We have Winston shooting the guy with the rat. We have Clarkson writing words for Vinny. Well, is there anything that uh, anything on the list that I can help with? Um, I mean, at the moment, no, not really. I think you guys are, like you said, really self-driven, so I definitely appreciate that. Um, you know, you're working on the lean stuff. You're working on uh, this investigation with Flop and um, about Jeffy. I mean, uh, there's not much more I could ask for. You guys are doing great. I appreciate that you guys are enjoying, uh, you know, Ranger stuff. I'm enjoying it so much that I flew out of my car like Ziggy Bugs. <laughs> you want anything, Carter? Are you with us? We'll, we'll get him a snack. Yeah, we'll get him a little something. Carter strikes me as a pro protein kind of person. Hello. Hello. Hi. Do you work food? here? Absolutely. Yep, I guess I do. Yeah, Come we could use some food. I've seen the place since y'all redecorated. Oh, yeah, it's real nice, ain't it? It is. Ooh, okay. Right. So what can I get you lovely folks? Oh my gosh, okay. Um, well, I'm here right to pick up... Right now our swift combos are buy one get one free, just so you know. Ooh. Um, what do you have that's vegetarian? Oh, uh, you have a vegetarian? Let me take a look for you. We do have some potato dishes. They've got uh, potato soup. That'll probably be pretty good. That's actually with yeah, the that'll soup. that'll work. Too. Potato soup, and we also have roasted potatoes. Um, either one, to be honest. I'll, I'll take two meals for myself, and then uh, two for Bundy, I guess. What you'd like. All right, do you want full combos, or, right? Do you need food right now? Um... Actually, I'm, I'm just going to pick up a couple of their, um, uh, gosh, uh, strawberry shortcakes for linen, and then I'll be good. All right. All right. So how, how, many, and then, how many potato soups did you say you wanted? Uh, two. And two? Could okay. we make it the combo? Sure. No problem. So you want two potato combos? Yeah. And then um, no could I also get one order of the gumbo? Okay, sure. Let me just add that up for you. I'll just make it fresh. I need to talk to Shelby about getting uh, the PD All back right, on the see? back up here with you guys. Cool. All right, so it's going to be eight fifty, okay, before tax. Perfect. All right, and can I have your state ID, please? Uh, 1055. 1055? Uh-huh. All right, and I'll start getting that right for you. Then we had the bad warrant from Silas and the bad warrant from Ripley. Both probably need to be talked to about that. I don't know what to do about people writing not good warrants. I'm not, like... I don't... How do I fix that issue? Because it's so, it's so widespread that, like, it happens a lot. But I just don't know if people 
don't have the time to write them or, or how it's like slipping through and becoming such an issue because it's certainly not the first time I've been called about that. Something to bring up in the meeting. I mean, this is a shift one and a shift two officer. Yo, yo. What's up, Carter? I feel bad telling shift three stuff about the other shifts, you know? It's such a meme. Trying to make sure we can be in for you. Be your calm girl. You're used to it? Yeah, I know. And what was that extra main that you wanted again? A gumball, please. Carter, do you All want right. anything? Um. Shit, what's uh, what's the healthy option out here? I'm trying to, you know, I work out a I'm lot. I'm getting the potato soup. Heavy. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, you little vegetarian, right? Yeah. All right. And because you got the potato soup, the potato soup's actually buy one get one, so you actually got four of them. Okay. Ooh, okay. I'll just give you mine. I'll put them right here for you. Oh, yeah. There this you go. A, this is a bomb-ass spot, actually. I ain't never been I know. Look here. around. They just, they redecorated. Uh, hold there on. you go. I'll be there for you. There, 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 there you go. Yo, this spot is sick. <laughs> All right. I heard somebody wanted some shortcakes. Who was that? It's gonna be me. Let me yeah. get uh, right. Let Carter. me get three of your strawberry shortcakes. Okay, All right, okay. you one fifty before tax, and can I have your state ID, please? Uh, you there you can. go. It's one zero eight eight. Hell yeah. One zero eight eight. Shit. It's ma'am. Hell yeah. You need a drink too. All right, there you go. Uh, I got a drink on. Good on. All right, right. there it is. I love this place. So when I was living at the lighthouse, I came here every day. <laughs> I'd like to see, uh, I want to talk to Shelby to see if she can get this place uh, hooked back up on the, um, on the PD. Uh, it's like a real place that you would go. Isn't it so cool? Yeah, I like it a lot. So, yeah, uh, you know, I, I love you know, this city folk. We don't come out here too often. So, you know, this is all brand new to me. Talking to you, Miss Bartender. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm just saying we city folk don't come up here too often. It's it's just so pretty. It's like um experience for me. It's like a real restaurant. Oh, okay. All right, cool. And your shortcakes are on the tree for you, sir. Beautiful. She's got her whole Thank kitchen you, back there You're too. Welcome. Can I get you guys anything else? Uh no, I think I'm good. Are you sure, sir? Our swift combos are buy one, get one. Oh, nah, I see I already she already gave me some of hers. So, uh, I'm good. I uh, the it, decorators but... in the city have just been mm, nah, so, you so right wonderful oh, okay. in doing everything they do. I'm so proud of them. That's how you can tell it's a southern home cooking place. They're making you leave oh, with more facts. food. Facts. <laughs> the southern hospitality right there. That's big facts. You leave. Hey, baby, you ain't going nowhere unless you got some food, boy. I appreciate it. What's your name? My name's Lunar, and Lunar. don't worry right. about it. It's on the house. If they oh. want to yell at me, they can yell oh, at me. Oh, they got a little, like, chalkboard, okay. too. Appreciate it. Thank you. There you go. Aww. Let me see. Just got to look through the eyes. Yeah, it's a little oh, tricky, yeah. Okay. Oh, Enjoy. hell yeah. Thank you so much. Appreciate You're it. You're welcome. You better have a good-ass day. You too. You guys <laughs> keep us safe around here, so at least I can be. Take care, Lunar. Yeah. Any digits? Okay, you got yeah confidence. I don't need digits. I only get only get digits when I need them. Oh, all right, fair.
then again, I still remember the last time that uh, that you tried hitting on a woman. She ended up marrying me. So. Oh my! Did you just oh, killed the okay. man. Okay. I got you. Just gonna you just take shots at me right now. Huh? <laughs> I mean, look, that's what happened. Okay. This oh, man no. was over here offer, offering to take her out on a date, and she hopped in my car and asked for a ride along. She wasn't ready for the black juice, dog. All right. Oh, she wanted the snow bunny. Was. She wanted the snow bunny, dog. It's cool. Uh, That's not good. Looks like, looks like people are dying. Yeah, it does yeah. sound like people are dying. Looks like it's uh, happening on Lindsay Circus. Oh, all right, little soul. Well, I gotta take us back down to MRPD so that I can get clocked out. Uh... Okay, uh, well, uh, good news, Tessa. I got the medical, the last medical report I was waiting on for the lean thing. Lemon finished it tonight and sent it over to me. Um, so I should be able to polish off that letter tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to try to get it to Crane and the mayor. Uh, is there anybody else that you can think of that I should kind of address it to? Um, honestly, no. I think the mayor and uh, Chief Justice are probably the best people to get it. Yeah. Trying to make the scissor illegal? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the recommendation that I'm going to put in is that it be the same regulations that like uh, Oxy follows, right? Because they're both prescription medications now, so... Uh, I'll be honest, I don't know what the hell the DOJ is going to do about people... Because uh... <laughs> here's the thing, right? If you get a prescription for cough syrup, and then your method of ingesting that cough syrup is just to mix it up into some sprunk and drink it, it's not technically, like, it wouldn't be a violation of, like, having the stuff. It would just be stupid. Scissor. Uh, but I think uh, that kind of gets covered by, like, public intoxication and driving out of the influence and all that stuff anyway, right? So, yeah. Um, it's the same thing when people get oxy. We can't really stop them from popping three pills all at the same time, so... How long have you been working on this, uh, regulation? Mm, about a week and a half. Um, Carter, you don't even know the full story. Uh, I don't, man, because, like, look, I'm always on the streets. I hit the streets, man, and I just go hard. So I got Ooh. I got turned on to this investigation uh, because freaking Lennon went to work. We took our two days off, our Sunday and our Monday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, she went to work. She called me 30 minutes later and said Jeffrey I can't believe I'm saying this but a doctor just taught me how to make lean hell yeah and I said what <laughs> and she said yeah I asked them about the sprunk that's in the machine at the front and they said yeah you take that and mix it with cough syrup oh. you have in the pharmacy and it makes lean oh my god Oh. so oh, I immediately started digging into that stuff oh. uh, Henry oh, found on. some of it just sitting outside of the hospital um, turns out Dean Quincy admitted on the stand that he was supplying it to Crystal. Uh, oh, <laughs> like, oh, hell. an EMS gave it to a patient who then had an adverse reaction due to other medication they're taking. Uh, like, this, this stuff is actually wild with how many, like, government employees are just... They're just sipping being, on scissor. Yeah, they're just being idiots. So. Sip it. Yo, the doctors is wild. Yo, I heard the doctors is wildin'. I heard, um, I had Gunner, Gunner shot a doctor the other day because he, the doctor held him up. <laughs> yeah, I heard. That's about so that, crazy though. shit like that, man. That's wild, boy. Hitting up that scissor. Um, so yeah, I'll get, uh, I'll get that, uh, done and I'll shoot it over to you tomorrow for. Do, do you want final approval or is what I've got so far sufficient? Yeah, you could send it to me and I'll take a look at it. Okay. I'll shoot it over to you tomorrow for final approval and whatnot. We can chat about it. Sounds good. Right, player? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna have yeah, to yeah. Wait too. Word, word, word. Alright. Well, I'm still at this bitch for another two, three hours, so yeah. Heck yeah. Alright. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Well, Carter, Game Warden, if either of you need 
Okay, that's a what that's a, in the heck? Truck. Why? Um, Why? What's going on? It looks like a lot of cops apprehended that truck. Uh. Heal the so you don't feel left out. Uh, two okay. Two meth a shitload of guns and dirty money, and apparently it was in a public parking spot where other people had access to it. So it sounds like about 15 people are about to get locked down. Jesus. Okay. Hello. All right. Is this a hey, Tessa, thing? it's Norman. Oh, yeah. Um, okay. I just wanted to let you know, I went up and just had a very long conversation okay. with Mr. Barrett. Um, we are on the same page as far as everything goes. He's a bit more at ease now. Um, All right. it's just, we need to find are a you still number with him? that, uh, uh, I just left the prison. Oh, okay. I got him some gumbo. I was going to bring it up to, uh, oh. EOC. Oh, yeah. Uh, he might still be awake, but I'm just now, I just left the prison. So. Okay. And, uh. Chidansky had my phone while I was in there, so, you know, no security worries. purposes and everything. Okay, um, yeah, just, uh, waiting on the final deal from, uh, from the Chief Justice, and then we should be all set for him. Excellent. I Perfect. appreciate that. Um, I did get in contact, uh, well, I, I sent an email over to Mueller just to let him know that you're looking to speak with him. Uh, I did so. as well. Excellent. So. Okay. Then I think we're all good. Sounds good. Appreciate you as always, Tessa. No problem. Thank you for the help. Yep, you take care. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Okay. Norman Adams. Okay. The, the, no, no, the, the EMS trans, local EMS took her to Sandy oh, and then, okay. yeah, local EMS took her to Sandy and then our EMS took her from Sandy to Crusade for uh, medical, so. Uh, I was actually just talking to Flop about that. I'm going to have him try to pull records from her because there's about a one hour time. She was calling me and texting me like an hour before everything happened. So if we can kind of get a snapshot of what that last hour looked like, we might might be able to drum something up, but it's unlikely. So um, if you want to push that with Flop, then you can feel free. Um, but I'll, I'll get the regular report in probably first thing tomorrow morning. No, I did all my detective stuff with police yesterday after we opened for the case in less than an hour. I'm retired. <laughs> oh, okay, perfect. Okay. I'm gonna go, uh, take a few minutes to myself. Because go I need time to acclimate <laughs> myself to where I am right now. Okay, <laughs> alright. Uh, uh, but thanks for riding with Sounds me. Good, Tessa. It was good Yo, Tess, it was day. great. Yeah. Yeah, it was great. All three of us. Sorry, I wasn't exactly yeah. uh, present. Oh, it's all good, man. I was, yo. I was also, Flap, I'm sorry I, I hung up on you and I never called you back. No, no, you're fine. I was just was calling burning. to apologize that I didn't stick around yesterday. I got, there was too much going on yesterday. I ended That's up just, all right. I had to leave. Well, nice. I can relate. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to go inside. I'm going to hang out with Scout for a minute. And I'll be back out in a minute. Solid. All right, no problem. I need to find where Bundy just went. He's going to sleep. He's going to sleep. Damn it, Bundy! Bundy! Going to sleep. <laughs> he's gone, probably. Bundy! No, yeah. he's right there. Uh, I'm going to be honest. I heard locked down 15 people, and I just shut down. I can't. I don't want to think about it, dude. <laughs> I'm hiding, I'm hiding. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so scared. Okay, this is fine. Just not gonna question it. Just gonna. He's fine. He's he's fine. Okay. 
Oh man, I just got some food chat, so I am going to uh, take this time to get a minute and eat that, get up and walk around, um, you know, do my thing. But let's see. Oh, Tessa, why? What I'm gonna do in the meantime is I'm gonna bring up a video. Let's see, we'll get something from the YouTube. Which video do I want to do? Go ahead and go with this one. How am I sitting like that? Uh, listen, it's fine. This is fine. Oh no, my stream deck did this again. Dang it. Sorry, chat, give me a second to get oriented here. Mark myself 10, 7. And we are going to pull the video up. Scissors, shoot! Good. Yeah. Oh, Brad is the W. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, you're gonna be going with Espanoodle. Yeah. They're gonna be on Radio oh. 3.6. Okay. 3.6. Okay. All right. So we have three now, and what we're gonna be focusing on is now pursuits, and you guys are gonna be clear for pit, box, spike, and you guys are gonna have to deal with a footbell. All right. So you guys are going to be chasing the orange buffalo, two renowned terrorists, Tessa Lem and Marcel King, <laughs> known for stealing all the bunny rabbits and bringing <clears throat> them in grave seed is on the loose. <clears throat> oh my god. 5 h 2 Penny with the uh, orange buffalo corridor on C Road, turning right westbound. Stop! Oh, there's a rock! Continuing on, Grape Seed Mate. He is now obsolete to travel. Did not see that rock. Joan Lane. 542 taking continuing southbound, Joan Lane. Left. God, this car sucks. Ah, Jesus! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> crazy! <laughs> crazy! <laughs> what are you doing? Use locals. Oh my god! What do we do? They're psychotic! Oh my god! 
Remember when you're going for a box. Now westbound, cross the highway. See you going for pit. Ah, Jesus. Ah! Successful. We're now off road and see if it's traditioning westbound. Here, you guys try to get that pit or the box. <laughs> ah, jeez. Oh, my God, <laughs> he almost killed himself. Oh, <laughs> There's a tanker there, Sean. Be careful. <laughs> Primary take <the> pit. <laughs> Oh no! Hey, you get out of my way! Get out of my way! Ah! What do we do? What do we do? Oh no! Oh, they're trying! They're trying! So when you're going for those boxes, you really want to ease into them? Especially between bubbles and... Ah, it's successful. <laughs> it's good. It ain't built for cars. Okay, you want to be careful here. You don't want to ram them into the water. Oh, the car's this out. We got a bail. I'm chasing suspect red hair dressed all black female. I'm free. Uh, 1060 in the air. We lost eyes on the uh, individual wearing all black with red hair. We had the arcade. <laughs> now we're joining the uh, by the house, uh, eastbound. Should I get in the, on the roof of the house? Back to the bridge in uh, the least grape seat. Keep in mind what you have in your hand right now. He's already. Five eight, we left the needle. Get in, get in! Ah, get, up. get in! Why is there so many cars? Get in! Oh, the board bound beside the, beside the burn. Get in, oh, dummy! Oh, God. Ah. Praise the blood! Ah. Don't forget! Who's in the CV guy that ran him over? Oh! We got an individual! No! Oh, Jesus. God! Hey! Hey! Your hands! I'm gonna you see your hands! Put the, the gun down! Put the gun down! Get some hands, sir! Put the gun down! <laughs> put it down! Put it down! Yeah, put it down! No, you put it down! <laughs> she's, uh, she's been tasted. I got her on lethal! I got lethal! It's not working. <laughs> She's running She's northbound on the road. Okay, in the car. Going westbound. <laughs> I don't know why I was escorting you. You can go watch. Hiding it. in a bush. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Sorry, you okay? <laughs> All right. Thing is, so a lot of things uh, went very badly there. Um, I decided to be kind of mean. I said I wasn't gonna, but then I, I you know, <clears throat> sorry. Left, northbound, Milton Road. Left. Westbound. Eastbound. Cat cars away. Vehicle U turning on cars away. Go for box, go for box. Sir, get out of the vehicle, put your hands up, turn the engine off right there. 
I got tasers. Sir, I'll do Get out of the car. All right, all right. Put your hands up right now. Put your hands up right now. Put your hands up. Nope. Put your guns away. Put your guns away. I'm chasing a vest. My individual's going uh, southbound on foot, going into the bush. He gets so caught up on the bushes. 1075 on my location. The original vehicles. 877's on my location. Uh, lady's in the bush. <laughs> I'm asking her multiple times to get out. I can't see her. I don't know What's if she ran location? away. Wait, I got this. Fuck, my GoXLR is not working. Never mind. Oh, and your medic just died too. In a bush. Yeah. And we're all down. We're getting up right now. Okay. Facing him on foot with what I believe was your I taser. Lost you. Uh, yeah, you lost me on the first bush. I just kept running. It was really funny. You kept running. That's though. what I thought. Uh, all right. Listen up, cadets. I want each and every one of you to understand one thing. If there's one thing that you take away from this entire presentation, it's this. You are all dreamless worms. None of you may aspire to become a ranger until you are a full officer. Do not approach me and tell me you want to be a ranger. Do police work, do your jobs, and you will get recognized. Am I clear on that? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> All right. Can you hear me? Well, thank you for understanding. Uh, so what we're going to do just to start us off is that um, uh, we're going to show you guys a little uh, sort of demonstration or rather um, a scene that you will come across if you go and try to do any kind of ranger work. Uh, and that is how you get recognized to become a ranger in the future. So if that is something that you aspire to be, once you are done being a dreamless worm, help us. Okay. Um, Dulio, I don't know if you want to have them all go over there and uh, look at what we did, but um, I think that would be best if we do that first. Okay, yeah, that works. Okay. Um, I guess follow me and Dulio, and we're gonna go show you guys something. Please ignore the dead rangers over here, they're fine. Alright, oh god, there's so many of you. But we want you guys to look at this scene over here. Uh, it's gonna be kind of right at our feet. Uh, and this is the kind of stuff you're gonna run across if you go up to the mountains, uh, in the night. Uh, Mount Josiah is where the hunting zone is, but anywhere above Route 68, you might come across a scene like this. Now, the first thing you'll notice is that there are casings around the area. And then the, uh, the next thing you want to notice is the carcass that's on the ground. So what you'll see is it looks a bit like the DNA that you'll find on the ground. Um, but it's, it's red and it, it's technically supposed to represent an am aminal carcass, so, uh, you know, that that's how you would roleplay that out. And based on the carcass that you'll see, you'll see that the person that skinned it, their state ID will show up. That is how you match the uh, ballistics of the bullet to the carcass itself. So when somebody is hunting, you'll also see that they, once they skin something, they will be holding a pelt in their hands. You can kind of tell the difference between the bad pelts and the good pelts. And that, that can also be used as evidence if you take a photo of somebody who has been hunting and they're carrying something like that. Hi, you're receiving a collect phone call from... We are currently uh, westbound. Uh, went around 
If you'd like to continue, please press 1. Great. Please hold. <laughs> Hello? Hi, is this Dominic Freddy? Great, great. We're just calling to see if you wanted to renew your, uh, Peaches magazine. Is that correct? Is that, is that what I'm reading right here? Oh, well, Mr. Toretti, we're looking at your logs from about six months back, and we see that for the last six months, you've been paying forty nine ninety nine to subscribe to Peach Magazine, which is all facts and photos about, uh, Peach. Um, would you, would you, uh, now, th this happens all the time, and it's totally fine that, you know, sometimes, the, you know, your card doesn't work because you don't have the funds, and that's okay, because... This is where, this is where I come in. You have money? You think you have money? Okay, do you, do you think that I should, okay, would you like to talk to finance then? You know what, I'll put you through the finance, just hold please. Your call's important to us. Please hold on and stay right there. <laughs> Hello, it's me again. <clears throat> Hold on. Uh, okay, so that's my fault. I, <laughs> I'm, I'm finance, but I should have transferred to collections, which I can do that right now instead. <laughs> Hello. Just one department here. It's just me and all the phones. I just like to have fun here. Okay. All right. Okay. Right. So. Are you okay? So just I just need you to verbally say I just need you to verbally say uh, that you that you don't like Peach and that you want to unsubscribe from her magazine. Okay. okay. I hear you're upset right now, sir, and I need you to bring that tone down just okay. a little bit because I'm just doing my job. It's not my fault that you're out here horn dogging it up. It's Six months subscriber, not a horn dog my ass. Do you know what this magazine entails? <laughs> Look at these photos in here. Jesus Christ. Okay. All right. Should we also unsubscribe you from the ear subscription? Subscriptions. It's 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 a it's an ears only. It's kinda like OnlyFans, except it's only ears. What the heck happened here? Hey, he is game. Ooh. Ooh. A man should have died tonight, and he escaped. <laughs> relax, Who? Alex. Relax. He's talking about his dog. He lost his dog, guys. Who is and name A guy named Larry should have died. He should have died, and he escaped. Listen, I'm telling you, that guy never it's killed your snitch. dog. My dog died. Okay. My dog died. Did, did someone <laughs> illegally discharge a firearm here, and you're just covering up with a dog story? Uh, we have no idea what we're talking about. Nice. Okay. Uh, Pilba, uh... Pilbus, I almost called you Pilbot. Hello. Um, I've got a plan for you. Oh, hell yeah. So why do you need to do the uh, Scouts program? Well, you know, I'm a civilian now that I'm on bail. So I was just, you know, I wanted to, you know, experience nice civ stuff and maybe go hunting and fishing the legal way. And uh, I just, you know, I wanted to see nature and, and, and learn about all these cool things and all these animals and stuff and see what's up, you know. What was the uh, situation that caused you to lose your hunting or fishing license? Can you explain it to me? Well, I lost my hunting license like a year ago. I actually don't even really remember what happened with that. Actually, I do. I, I think I, with the hunting license thing, I think... This is actually when I was still like, you know, I wasn't a bad guy back then. I got attacked by a mountain lion and I shot it and then I skinned it. And I didn't know that was illegal. And I should have read the laws. That was my bad. All right. We made it oh. to our destination. Oh, no. So you remember what I said about community service, Pilbus? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I think you have some idea as to what's coming next. All of them? Yep. You got uh... You're the one who poached. 
You'll be all right. What do I even? You just you gotta get in there. <coughs> I, just be careful of all that splashback. They call it Poseidon's kiss. <coughs> <laughs> this is fucking disgusting. Oh, uh, when's the last time we were clean, Tessa? <laughs>
Scout looks how I feel right now. Girl, please. You gotta get up. Honey, I cannot. I literally scout. Okay, hold on. Hold on, chat. Yep. Oh, God. Okay. A scout, please. We cannot be like this. <laughs> you gotta come with me. <clears throat> Is he? Okay, he doesn't like it in here. Oh my god, I was not ready for that. Oh my god. Why is he so extra? Oh, that was unlocked. Ooh. Oh. Who? Who? Ooh. No. Roy? <clears throat> okay, this car does not look okay. I think I need to get it fixed. Oh, God. Okay. I'm sorry? My bad? Are these numbers still right? Three, six. They're not. What would they be now, though? I would imagine that's probably right. Jesus Christ. 
ignore that, ignore that, ignore that, ignore that, ignore that. Disregard. 311, disregard. Everybody, disregard. All right. Um. So, our to-do list. Uh, can I get a 77 here? Ask about rehiring Roman Park and Joey Keys. We need to figure out our badge situation. Ask if Damien can dispatch from the station if he gets dispatch. Uh, see if we need a fridge at the station. Um, Craig Barrett's thing has been sort of resolved for now. Ending. The Cosby and Royal harassing Andy and Pilba situation. I still need to talk to someone from their command. Um, Winston's thing. We're waiting on Winston. The Vinny thing might have been resolved. I don't know. No. Dispatch 450, show me try and catch up to a fast ass car going westbound Boulevard del Perro, standby. It's weird that Vinny doesn't have a picture. So this warrant was kind of brief. This seven was on daily patrol when a white R34 pulled up. Inside of the vehicle was Vinny Pistone, who had no mask on, was ID'd by face and voice. This seven informed Vinny to hand himself in for the warrant. However, Vinny held up AJ Hunter from his car with a pistol and evaded, which led to a chase. <laughs> uh. I can't even figure out a way to word that. Uh, he can't drive, so he decided to call back up. Uh, 151 76 Lay Stay Boost. He decided to call back up Marcel yeah. Miller to pit 207 and escape. <laughs> okay. I mean, honestly, yeah, that's fair. Fair warrant. He got, uh, this is literally. Honestly, this is what was missing from the Silas warrant. Inside of the vehicle was P Vinny Pistone, who had no mask on and was ID'd by face and voice. That's uh, literally all that Silas warrant needed. And it probably would have been way more uh, acceptable. 